Hello, please. Hello, please, and welcome, welcome. I am Shinobi VTuber Robin Osiria. It is such a pleasure to be with you, everybody. We had some technical difficulties to start the stream, but it is going to be okay. I think we are good now. So welcome, welcome, everybody. How is everybody doing today? Welcome, welcome. Hello, please. Folks, give me, I'm going to, I'm going to read everybody's name. We're going to say hello, please, to everybody before we start playing the game. Hello, please. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Folks, I'm sorry we got a little started a little bit late today. I was on the phone with my mama. We were having a good chat, and I wanted to keep talking to my mama. So I uh I was doing that. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. I appreciate your support in that. Um, hello, please. To how is your mama? She's really, really good. She's doing really, really good today. And we were having a good chat. So I wanted to I wanted to talk to my mama. I wanted to talk to my mama a little bit. <laughs> but I think it'll be a lot, a lot of fun. Um but we're here, we're ready, and I'm I'm in a really, really good mood now. So we're going to we're gonna continue some Genshin Impact. We're gonna continue some Genshin Impact today. Welcome, welcome, folks. Shout out to Heavy Robot, who is the first person to the stream. Hello, please, to Millie and Don Slays. Momoshi the Lost, Caramel Latte, Reggie Boy. Hello, please, Reggie Boy. Hello, please, Shot Baller, Alyssa. Royal Brookley, Walrus Mother, Hash Loves You, Estella. Hello, please, Majesty. Welcome, welcome. How are you doing today? Who else? Who else? Anybody else did I miss? Oh, Dawn Slaves. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hello, please. Hello, Wolf Knight. Hello, please, Edible Sylvie. How are y'all doing today? Welcome, welcome. Thank you, everybody, for being here. Over on the YouTube side, we have Infinity Kutsune, Gogeta Evolution, and I'd also like to thank anybody who is just hanging out and lurking and listening, I really, really, really appreciate everybody's support. How's everybody doing today? Y'all want to make myself a little bit bigger. I'm a little, don't you think I'm a little tiny? Don't you think I'm a little small over here? I'm a little, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm just a little, I'm just a little thing over here. Oh, please. You're so cool. You got told hi two times. Hey, I wanted to make sure that, I wanted to make sure that I did. Okay. I wanted to make sure that I did. I really, really appreciate everybody being here. Okay. Folks, uh, a couple quick pieces of business. If you didn't know, in the Discord, I don't, I didn't think up all the links today, but in the Discord, um, if you're watching on YouTube, it's available in the video description. If you are watching on Twitch, I just put it in the chat. Um, the Discord announcement. I made two announcements. Okay, we have opened up moderator applications. Moderator applications are now open. So if you're interested in helping improve our shinobi sanctuary community please 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 consider checking out the moderator application regardless if you're new to the community regardless if you are a bit more of a lurker you don't have to be like an active chatter whatsoever um to be accepted i got a really really good application from someone who is more a bit more of a lurker um so please 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 regardless of how often you've been in the community or anything please 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 consider consider applying um We've also opened viewer pull forms. Uh, I'm going to use one form this time for everything. So we have viewer pull forms for Acheron 6 in reverse 1999. And we have, I'm actually going to put that form on the screen. Uh, I don't want to, we don't need to air the moder. you know, people who aren't in the Discord probably don't need to uh, know about that. But we do have the viewer pull form. This is for Acheron 30, uh, Acheron 6. And anybody who, uh, I'm going to make that better. And anything in Genshin Impact. If you ever like me to pull in Genshin Impact, please pull out your form. Fill out your form. The way that viewer pulls work is I access your account on the stream, only on the stream. I don't show your information to everybody, um, but I only access it on the stream. So you can like leave your character in like a weird position or whatever. Just like any, however, whatever's best for you, right? And we will, uh, we will pull to your request we'll pull on whatever banner you want whatever your idea is um so we did that last patch and it was really really fun so i'd like to do it again okay so if you like me to pull on your account please fill out the form we'd be happy to do it i plan to do acheron viewer pulls on tuesday and i want to do uh reverse pulls and any genshin pulls on thursday that's the plan robert i have four pulls do you think i'll get acheron i don't think you will don believes in you i don't i don't think that i do I don't think that I'm, I don't think four pulls is enough to get Akron. You spent all your luck on Black Swan, Sylvie. 
Robin is here to share some streamer luck. I sure am. I sure am. We gotta share some of your our streamer luck for you, with you, with you all. Okay. Oh my gosh, I don't even have my controller plugged in for Genshin Impact, folks. I am like so. I'm a little bit behind today. Okay. I'm a little. I'm a little bit behind today. So I appreciate everybody's patience. I appreciate everybody's love. Um. We had a good. We were having a good day today. Hello, please. Not a sad oak. How are you doing today? Welcome on in. Welcome on in. What I'm going to do for the, um, what I'm going to do for the, my Acheron pulls is I'm going to pull for her light cone first. If I don't get her light cone, then I'm not going to get her. She's worthless without a, without a, a light cone. She's worthless without a light cone, dude. <laughs> Bravery pulls, but the outcome is not good. It's not good. It's not good. It's, it's kind of tough. But Robin to pull for Arena, but it's too early for you to apply. Yeah. Uh, I, I will delete the form after our our polls are complete. So like I would really like to delete the form on like Friday. So we only I only have viewers in poll account information. Preferably like I like to have like viewers account information like as little time as possible. And I only look at it while we're on the stream. Um so I try to I try to keep things really, really secure for everybody. Hi, I heard radio, radio player. Welcome back. How are you doing today? What'd you miss? We started uh, Inazuma Archon Quest. What was that on Tuesday? And today we are continuing it. Uh, we've just been today. We've just been chatting so far. We've been hang hanging out, having a good time. Folks, shall we go ahead and get into the game? I uh, I feel like this will actually help me get a better sense of what's going on. As soon as we start the game, I'll, I'll become more centered. I know it. I can feel it in my bones. Oh my gosh, my, why is my mic doing this? Folks, today is a scuff stream start. Today is a scuff, scuff stream start. Nobody told me that my, my mouth was just up, 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 yapping the whole time. See, welcome moon. Activate the welcome moon, folks. Our radio is doing good. How about you? I am doing pretty, pretty good today. I had one of my favorite pieces of food. I had some, I had some chicken. For lunch, for dinner, it was very, very good, and uh, yeah, I've been I've been having a good day. Oh, I watched the new Walking Dead episode last night. Sadly, it was kind of mid. It was really good, like for what it, for being the Walking Dead, right? Like I like the Walking Dead, so I like it. But sadly, of all the episodes, it was kind of mid. Why wait? Why do I need don't? Why would I need tissues in Inazuma, folks? This is a great opportunity to remind you there is a strict no spoiler policy in place of the streams this is my first time ever playing genshin impact so i really really do not want any of the uh, plot details spoiled in the game i um really another another thing that i wish to mention we will be updating our rules and guidelines as we like take a look at all the moderator applications right um but i do really really wish to uh discourage backseat gaming at this point okay I, I do not need folks to explain things to me when I do not ask, you know, I do not need game mechanics explained to me, um, character relationships, future details, you know, unless I ask, please. Okay. So if I'm running, so if I, for an example would be, if I'm running around as little Nahida Bean, right, it's, it wouldn't be necessary to comment multiple times that taller characters climb better. You know, it's like, I know that I understand and it's not that serious. Okay. So really, really our focus folks is just having fun. Y you can get through the game doing whatever you want. Right. And it's totally, totally okay. No, everything, every, everything's okay. Every, everybody's done. Every, everybody's been great today. Everybody's been, everybody has been really, really wonderful recently. Um, I've just tried to like, I've, I've. <sighs> I have had difficulties not expressing my boundaries in the past, and so I have determined that it will be better for our community and for everyone's enjoyment if it was just like a super, super clear what we what we can all expect from each other, if that makes sense. Hello, please, love. Hello, please, Camille. How are you doing today? Welcome, welcome. Hello, please. Billy is going to miss the Edo banner. And wait for Lenny. Is Lenny's a five star, right? Lynette is the four star character, his sister. 
Also, folks, if anybody wishes to join me to do these commissions real quick, please, please, please. Feel free. Feel free. Are you having a good day? I am. I am having a good day. So far, I ate uh, I ate some chicken and mashed potatoes and corn. And we're having a good day. We're having a good day. How about you? Makes total sense. You need your boundaries. Yes, I've been... Look, I... How do I say this? I've been trying to be really, really... I've been trying to be really, like... Encompassing of everybody. I don't know if that's if that's the right word. It. I just. I have determined that things will be better if we're a little bit firmer on some on some boundaries. By the explorer, you travel to every island after getting out of Ritu. Very very cool. That's very very cool. Oh, I gotta link him up as Nahida Beam. Like R is gonna get ice cream. Yo, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. How are you doing today, Majesty, folks? If we can please get a shout out for our friend majesty she's so 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 wonderful i was awake whenever she started her stream this morning i was laying in bed and i was low-key like waiting for majesty to go live like i checked her schedule and i was like when what time are you gonna be live bro and uh she went live and i got to say hello please to majesty before i i went to sleep but i listened i listened for a while it was a, it was a, i'm very very glad i got to catch some of your stream this morning i'm very very glad Nahida beans. I love. Yeah, we love the Nahida beans. Estella is fast. Thank you, Estella, for the shout out. If you type slash shout out, it also gives the uh, it does the thing to like looky here, like sh slash. Like if you type slash shout out, I'll I'll type it and then I'll do it. It's slash shout out. Majesty. Oh my goodness. And then I'll do it and I'll show you. I'll show you what it looks like. Wow. Huh? All will be revealed in the next volume. Oh, drat. Boom, and then up. Wait, wait, that's not her. Wait, that's not her. Wait, that's not Majesty. Wait, that's not Majesty. Oh my gosh. Wrong Majesty. Wrong Majesty. You should follow this Majesty, but I can't do it for another one minute and 46 seconds. I, this isn't the first time that I've shouted out. Um, That's not the first time I've shouted out random majesty <laughs> but will he lets us use the basic one see that's why that's why I, on the moderator form i asked i was like do you watch a mobile or pc because i understand that there's some discrepancy between the the functions Did you know that the sound of i appreciate you real brooklyn i i love all, everybody too thank you love i appreciate you i hope you're having a good day Yeah, we support we support Majesty. I do like Taylor Swift. I enjoy I do enjoy Taylor Swift. I the thing that wait hold on I gotta pick both of them. Folks, has anybody been doing these here? Uh, the event I haven't touched the event in like a week. Where do I gotta go? Uh, I go G to evolution. How you doing today? Oh, it's only it's all it's like two feet that way. Yeah, the new event, the alchemical alchemical he ha, -ha event. I started I started it and then I was like, I, I did everything that we needed to do on like day one, but I uh, <sighs> I haven't done any Honkai Star Rail events either. I haven't done any Honkai Star Rail events either. It's crazy. Well, I did the I did one of them. I did the like one that you actually play the video game in. You know, you got to do combat. But I haven't done the um I haven't done the one where you push around the the thing. Like you you change the reflection of the beam. I haven't I haven't done that one yet. Are you going to do Inazuma soon? Yes, we are going to complete our commissions and then we are going to start Inazuma Archon Quest. I like to do commissions at the start of the stream so people have a chance to come in and we can kind of we can kind of talk and yap yap to each other real quick. Well, we have lots of yapper energy. Yap yap yap. I like to yap. I'm a yapper. 
yapping. One of the one of the first Genshin Impact streams I ever watched is there. There's a VTuber that I follow, and I don't like to name names. You know, I don't want to. I don't want to involve people for if it's not relevant. But there was a VTuber that I was watching, and she was streaming Genshin Impact, except she was the game was completely muted, and she was doing karaoke of musical theater songs to it so she would be she would like do the cutscenes right and she would just skip 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 dialogue skip 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 sing once again with me a strange to head my power over you grow stronger yet and I'm, and I'm just like i was like this is epic this is i liked i like to get to that vibe one day it was like it was iconic yeah it was it was absolutely epic it was awesome <laughs> it was so fun. And I was like, dude, this is kind of dope. Hi, King Platypus. How are you doing today? Also, hello, please, to Soap. I, I saw Soap come in. I hope you're having a good day, Soap. Robin singing. I we I sing a little bit. I sing a little bit. I've done, I've done karaoke streams in the past. I want to do... I want to do a... Uh, Robin should do a singing stream now. I have done a singing stream before on YouTube. There is a, uh, I did an archive karaoke and then I've, I've released a cover song too. Don't mind me, I'm just Nahida stomping. I was doing little heat steppies. <laughs> Dude, why did the monsters come up in the eye? Why did why did the monsters come up in the sky? You got to do Taylor versions of songs. I wanted to do. I was gonna sing "Bejeweled" by Taylor Swift at a karaoke stream, but there are two properties, like there are two media giants that I'd really prefer to not like trifle with, right? And I think that there are two people. The two people that you should not mess with are uh, is Disney and Taylor Swift. Okay, those are the two those are the two media properties that I truly have no interest in agitating. Nintendo as well. Nintendo is actually like Nintendo definitely applies, but in terms of music specifically, or like copyright law well Nintendo's pretty Nintendo's pretty copyright friend unfriendly as well. But I uh But I uh forgot what I was gonna say. That's awesome, good G to evolution. A lot of companies are terrifying with copyright. Yeah, it's no fall in the water, Nahita. Please fall in the water. No, God dang it! This happens all the time. Dang it! Is it will tear down someone's house for having a baby named Mario? I don't is it is it I don't do you have evidence? Any any proof? Documents? <laughs> uh, let's go. Yeah, I I I I had a little bit of Minecraft. I definitely that I didn't I don't take like a lot of Minecraft principles and apply them to larger video games but falling in water equals invincibility is definitely one of them that's definitely one of them that i like i i thought i thought happened the memes are enough evidence memes memes are eh, I, I i i tend to agree <laughs> i tend to agree thank you all for helping me with my commissions i really really appreciate it feels weird seeing the stream load later than the game yeah you guys are the the first the first focus group Thank you for completing. Nintendo will generally go swiftly towards things Add that parody their properties. It's true. It's true. I saw the other day people were getting people were getting struck for stuff that was it, years ago, years ago, years ago, years ago. So I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Folks, should we? Is there anything that I need to farm today? 
Is there anything that I need to farm today? I think we have a little bit. We have a little bit of yapping left in us today. I believe. I believe that we do. I believe that we do have a little bit of yapping left in us today. Is this a Sunday? Welcome back, Wolf Knight. Hope you're having a good day. Primo Gym? I have over 10,000 Primo Gyms. I have over 10,000 Primo Gyms. Dude, why why is the default button to swap out my characters? This is such nonsense. Chivalry will never die. Time to broaden the horizons again. Sunday equals farm whatever you want day. Yo. Let's go. For justice. Dude, it always messes up my character order. Time is against us. Why are you to do this? Lead the way. Follow me. Hi, Lost Ross. How are you doing today? Hello, please. Dude, last night I was we were playing a little bit of Genshin in Discord last night, which was really, really comfy. It was really nice. And dog, we determined I can battle these domains up to like level 69. Like I can take these level, I can fight these level 59 domains with few problems. Now we might we might get exposed here on the on the stream currently, but I was having no problems last night. We we're having a good time. Hi Osaka, is this Fortnite? This is not Fortnite. This is Genshin Impact, but welcome, welcome. Hope you're having a good day. Get wet. Nakaara says, I might quit Genshin Impact for a while because you don't have any reason to play it for the time being. So what would what would bring you back to Genshin Impact? What's got you what's got you burned out of Genshin? And what would bring you back? The brightest flames Wait, but bye, Shing Show. Shit. See, now I'm yapping. Now I'm I'm talking. I've been talking. It's gonna get me killed. Yes, yesterday I played Minecraft. Yesterday we were streaming Minecraft. Today we're playing Genshin Impact. Waiting for another story update in Genshin. Honestly, that is that's pretty valid. That's super valid. Don't be scared. How do I get? Wow, I do have a. I didn't realize that I had a res item for Shingsho. Let's go. You even played all of the world quests? That's kind of, yo, that's a lot. That's a lot of questing. I'm impressed. Hi, Aura Galaxy. Hype for Inazuma Day. Yes, we're gonna, we're gonna go over to Inazuma pretty dang quickly here in a second. Fighting this, showing, trying to show off, fighting this, uh, Domain has not gone qu quite as well as I hoped. Stella hates world quests. They're annoying and incredibly long. What makes you, what makes you say that? I kind of like world quests because I don't have to pay attention to anything, right? I can like listen to music and then I can, I can just play, make progress. What kind of songs do I like? Right now, I'm really, really obsessed with Porter Porter Robinson. Porter Robinson is my favorite musical artist right now. I like uh, I like like I like soft electronic music. You know, like melodic electronic music, where there's like there's like it's like electronic instruments, right? But it's not necessarily like boom 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 boom. boom. It's a, it's very like sing songy electronic music. I don't know if there's like a better exact genre to describe that but that's how i feel you decided to start honkai impact third during easter night folks i'll tell you i installed honkai impact third i installed honkai impact third have you listened to everything goes on don't try to make yourself remember darling don't look for me i'm just a story you've been told so let's pretend a little longer because when we're gone everything goes on do 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 
<laughs> I love that song. I would probably cover it if every VTuber in the world hasn't already covered it. I'll tell you, you can't tell anybody, but I wanna, I really wanna cover the brand new Porter Robinson song, Cheerleader. I really, I really wanna cover it. I wanna do, that might be my next cover song. I've also, I'll, I will confirm, I've looked into it. Okay, I've looked into it. They hate having to grind bosses to build characters, right? I, uh... Yeah, I don't I don't think that I'm going to like grinding domains. Somebody says uh in game, in game, somebody said a minute ago that in game of Genshin Impact is kind of tiring. Y yeah, I don't think that I'm going to be I don't think that I'm going to like that. I'm used to Honkai Star Rail where you uh where you just it auto plays everything. My team is so powerful, I can auto play anything in the game. So, I don't there's no I'm like what? I go to a domain and I'm like, "Why do I have to like play this? This is kind of this is kind of silly." Don't you say? Uh. Let's check this out. You grind for characters before you pull them. Honestly, pretty cool. Honestly, incredibly valid. Dude, this menu is kind of goofy. This is, uh, this is kind of silly. Wait, how could I, why, why did I not get any of these? Yeah, I just don't even want to deal with this right now. I look at the, I look at the... Character ascension, weapon ascension. I'm just like, yeah, I just don't want to deal with this right now. You aren't guaranteed to get characters, so why grind and have a chance of never getting them? Who said you aren't guaranteed to get characters? So, yeah. Oksana, Genshin Impact doesn't have, have seasons. This is version 4.5 in Genshin Impact. We're not doing anything in the in the new patch today. We're just hanging out. We're playing old story, okay? Uh, let's go ahead and start making our way over to Inazuma, shall we? I uh, I really don't want to farm. Folks, do, do anybody want to join and help me do ley lines? Do we finish up some ley lines? I don't want to farm. I don't want to. I don't want to farm materials and stuff i don't want to, i don't want to use my brain what do you think this is true in game genshin is sad you log in to do dailies resin an event and then you log out many such cases see i get what you're saying Camilla, because you do have to win 50 50 you're not guaranteed to get all the characters but i am but I'm not a free-to-play player. If you're not, but that's the thing. If you're not a free-to-play player, if you're a free-to-play player, right, you're not guaranteed to get all the characters. But if you're not a free-to-play player, you're guaranteed to get all the characters if you want. Like Acheron, for example, I knew that I was going to get Sparkle in Honkai Star Rail. I knew that I was going to get Sparkle in Honkai Star Rail, so I pre-farmed for her. But... I don't, uh, but I don't, um, oh, what was I going to say? I totally lost my train of thought. Um, oh, Acheron. I'm not, I'm not married to getting Acheron. I would like to, I would like to get Acheron, right? It'd be fun. I think she's a cool character. I think she looks cool, but I'm not I'm not just like married to getting her right Like if I don't get her light cone, then I'm just not gonna pull for her I'm not gonna spend all the jades to get her and her light cone as well But so if it's a character that you know you're gonna get and you're willing to do whatever you have to do to get the character It makes it's a lot of fun to pre-farm it. I had a lot of fun Pulling sparkle and then beating MOC with her on day one. That was a lot of fun. I had a lot a lot of fun and so we, uh, it's definitely fun to pre-farm a character. I started to pre-farm Acheron, but I was like, but then I realized I'm really, I really don't think I'm quite as married to her, to pulling her as I thought I was. Like if I don't, if I don't get her light cone, I don't want her. I'm, I'm legit, I'm literally going to pull on the light cone banner first. 
Oksana, yes, we are doing co-op plays with the chat. With the chat. Folks are joining the world and help, help co-op play it. Sometimes you like seeing them slowly build up instead of being immediately overpowered. It is, I do, I see that as well. It is satisfying to build a character. It's satisfying to build a character, but like pre, like pre farming a character gives me the same feeling of like, gives me the same feeling of like getting advanced on my, on my homework, right? Like I feel like I, I feel like I did my homework early. Oksana, I gotta ask you, please stop asking so many questions. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This is not, we're playing Get Your Impact. Today is not a Q&A session, unfortunately. Uh, you 100% sip towards Firefly for some reason. You decide to save so you can get a lot of her stuff. I cannot wait to see what that, how all that is gonna play out. I don't know. I don't know what's gonna happen. I don't know what's gonna happen. Yeah, folks, I ask I ask everybody to please keep the please keep the I, I just kindly ask everybody as as we're talking and as we're playing this stuff. Let's try to keep all the comments on topic. Uh, please, please help. Please, let's I, I like to stay on one path of the current conversation. You know, when we, when we drift off somewhere, we'll go there. But I, I really I like to try to respond to everybody's questions and comments and stuff and go and go all stuff and i realized that, like it's it sometimes it might be a little hard to listen to right i'm, I'm gonna try to keep everything i'm gonna try to be ah, i'm a fart i'm going to try to provide more focus as a streamer as well What is your best artifact? I don't have a clue. I do not know or care. <laughs> Last night I did Nahida domains, the Nahida domain in Sumeru, like the artifact domain. I spent my whole resin there and I didn't get anything the whole time. I was like, this is stupid. This is stupid. Hi, Pterodactyl, how are you doing today? Hello, please. Illusion shattered. My flower artifact for Nahida is the best at the moment. Let's see. Yeah, it's this one. We have a, uh, wait, it's not that one. It's this one. I have a elemental mastery and attack Nahida Labyrinth Wayfarer, Flower of Life article. So I have the Dendro stat bonus. I got you, Camille. I got you. I got you. I got you. Let's see. Uh, more there's more more to do more to do more to do more to do can someone put my mask back on i just realized that i don't have my mask on thank you Estelle. i appreciate you thank you thank you thank you thank you royal brokerly and anybody else who may have Use your Twitch channel points to put my mask back on. <laughs> Another test subject. That tingle? You ever have a dream where you're playing Genshin? No. Shine down. Where's the next ley line? I've had I've had really really terrible sleep recently. Like I haven't been able to sleep at all. Like my brain, do you, folks. Does anybody ever get like too bored to sleep? Right? Like you're laying there and you're trying to close your brain off and trying to sleep, and my brain's just like, yeah, but I I'm bored. I need to be stimulated. Happens to you? It does. It does, folks.
despair. I know it, it's so it's so it sucks. So like I need to rest. I need to relax, and my brain is like. But what if someone farted on the other side of the of the universe, and, and you need to know about it? I really, I really do be scrolling, though. I really do be scrolling pretty a lot recently. Well, actually, I'm. I, I think actually I haven't. I think that that's why I've been so my. I think that's why my mental has been has been weird recently. It's because I haven't been scrolling. I haven't been. I haven't been bed bed rotting and scrolling on my on my phone. You know, I've confronted the world with its full challenges and difficulties, and I've I've had few coping mechanisms. <laughs> Hi, evil cat. You heard a cat meow. Meow. Was it me? Welcome back, Infinity Kutsune. How was your walk? Okay, we have no more resin. We have no more resin. So thank you, folks, for playing. Thank you for helping me. I appreciate you. I'm locked in here. Okay, bye bye. You sleep aid ASMRs? Yes, there are ones of Nahida. Shh, hold the phone. Hold on. Hold on. Please post this in the Discord immediately. There's Nahida Sleep Aid ASMR. I need to listen to this immediately. Like, like stop the presses. I didn't know. I didn't know this existed. What they say is true. You have to see the world for yourself to appreciate how beautiful it is. Nahida, guard your dreams. Genshin Nahida ASMR roleplay. Friends, comfort. Wait. Hold up. Hold up. We're we're hold up. Oh my god. What have I done? One second. I have to I have to fix the transformation. One second. Quick, I I changed everything up the earlier. Oh yeah, look at this. Oh yeah, look at this. Oh yeah, look at this. Let's check this out. Nahida guards your dream. Genshin Nahida ASMR roleplay. Shout out to Loon ASMR, I'm going to post the link to this video into chats. Please, please, please support this creator. I've liked and subscribed to the video, so please, please, please consider checking out their videos, okay? Let's check this out. Loon ASMR does a very good venti. You confirm top tier. This is, you enjoy their content? I've never, I've never heard of their content before. Hi, John. Welcome, welcome. How are you doing today? You're finally here. Welcome. I've been waiting for your arrival. This place? This is a realm of dreams. I've guided you here from your own dream world to meet me here. <laughs> Don't worry, in the real world you're already in a deep sleep. I am simply here as a guard for your dreams, to keep you from having any unpleasant slumber. This is amazing. This is amazing. This is like the best thing I've ever heard. This is the best thing I've ever heard in my life. 
It's incredible. No, it's incredible. Dude, I had to, you have, look, sometimes you have to take like a, a leap of faith, right? When it comes to ASMR, you know, I thought I didn't understand ASMR for a long time. I didn't understand what the idea was, why anybody would listen to it. And you kind of, it's almost like, it's almost like going to see a theater performance, right? And the performer has like a microphone on their head, right? Like if you go to see a theater performance, the, sometimes the performers like so have a microphone on their head so you can see them and in order to enjoy the performance You kind of had just like have to accept that right? So I've thought I've thought some there's been times in the past that I've thought ASMR was a little strange too Perhaps a little slightly unsettling. You know what? It's pretty cool now that I've given it a proper chance It's pretty cool. It's a pretty good time Yeah, I think we found I think we know what I'm gonna be listening to tonight <laughs> Infinity Kitsune, are you are you going are you committed to getting Sparkle and Honkai Star Rail? You okay, you agree it is amazing? Estella says, wow, they did an incredible job. I thought it I thought it was really, really cool. I thought it, I really, really, really enjoyed it. Sparkle is gonna be really cool in Honkai Star Rail. I don't know if she's a most a must pull. I don't know if she's a must pull. I know I shielded her. I know I did. I know I was I was the CEO of Sparkle, Honkai Star Rail. She's really, really good. I mean, she's a five-star Harmony character, right? You should probably pull her. But... I don't know. I'm glad folks enjoyed it. I, I really, really encourage you to check out LUM. Is it pronounced LUM? L-U-M? LUM? ASMR? I really, really enjoyed that. I really, really enjoyed that. Mm -hmm. You pull every time you get a chance to. That is a problem. That is a problem. How how are you gonna save? Who are you gonna save for? Yo, folks. Yesterday, I pulled. I did one pull on Chiori's banner. So I had eighteen intertwined fates. I had eighteen intertwined fates, but yesterday I did one pull on the Chiori banner, and I got Dory. Look at this. Look at this. Would you look at this? Hi, Hydro Tail. How are you doing today? You saw your heart stopped? Yeah. I look, sometimes you gotta pull. Look, sometimes you have to pull. You gotta do it. Sometimes you have to pull. You pull in ones when you don't have someone to pull for. As soon as I found out which banner Arlequino would be here, you would start saving. Yeah, I'm saving for. I'm saving for Arlequino. I'm saving for Arlequino. Woman. Dude, I, I can never figure out how to get out of here. Okay, here it is. If you're not sure what to do next, you have Sparkle Light Cone by up. mistake and no Sparkle. Okay, the Light Cone is still really, really good though. John accidentally got you accidentally got Chiori when pulling for C4 Goro. And you have no pulls for Kazuha? No. Sign to stop pulling is when Bennett shows up. <laughs> Waiting for your Furina? Let's go. Dakara, you do have Sparkle. You have Sparkle and her Light Cone. Yo, let's go. Kitsune just needs Sparkle. Kitsune just needs Sparkle in general. Folks, I think that I'm. I think that we are gonna get into the Archon quest. Uh, well, I have I have something to say beforehand, but we're gonna we're gonna go over here because I put the timestamp in the YouTube video. Be like, hey, this is where we're actually starting the Archon quest. What act are you on? We are on... Chapter 2, Act 1. Chapter 2, Act 1. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, uh... I have a, hold on, I have a, I have a little, I have a little spiel to do. Hello, please. I'm Shinobi VTuber Robin Osiria. We are back here in Genshin Impact in Inazuma, and we will be continuing the Archon Quest, folks. We are in Chapter 2, Act 1, and we will be completing that today. Uh, I do kindly ask folks to not post spoilers in the chat or in the or the comment section below. Please, uh, please try to avoid backseat 
gaming, try to explain or tell me how to play. And I really, really appreciate everybody. Um, I know that the last time we played Genshin Impact Archon Quest, Inazuma Archon Quest, I was a little bit of a, a grump because I was expecting more from the story, okay? I wasn't really hoping to get into the martial arts tournament uh, that we were obviously going to win. It was a scripted win, and I didn't enjoy arriving in Inazuma, only be able to have the have the tax policy of Inazuma explained to me. So I think the idea, folks, is I'm going to be a little more honest with my reactions. If I think something, I've, I've been trying to keep like the good spirits, right? You know, be like, I've been, I've been real positive about everything. I've been real, um, real excited about everything. And what I realize is that maybe that's not necessarily what you're looking for. Right, so if I if I find something boring, uh, I'm gonna say so. I'm gonna be really, really frank and really, really honest. From now on, I've heard some reports that perhaps the Inazuma story isn't the most exciting of them all. So look, if we find some dialogue boring, NPC dialogue explaining boring, I'm gonna you know I, I might read it and and skip. We're not we might not sit and watch the NPCs say all of the dialogue. You know, if they're talking about the color of the grass you know we we might not we might not be listening to all that okay because i want to save my energy and i want to save my goodwill for all the like fun and good stuff in the story right so i want to save like my energy and our attention because i have a limited attention span right i want to save our energy and our attention for like the hot like the the really really good stuff okay so i don't really like like that's to say, we're not going to be like skipping NPC dialogue all the time or anything. But if if things start to if things start to slow down, right, we're going to try to pick it up. Is what I'm trying to say. You personally really like Inazuma. It is the most controversial quest line out of the five. Yes, I will. I will be giving it a fair shake. You know, I want it to be fun. Of course, I want it to be fun, and I want us to have a good time together. But us having a good time together. I think is more important than like, you know, okay, let's, uh, you know, like force positivity or anything. So we're going to be, we're going to be really, really real with our playthrough. I've been, I feel like we've been pretty honest and everything up to this point in the playthrough. Um, but I've, I've tried to keep the vibes perfect, immaculate and stuff. So when things slow down in the story, you know, I'm going to, we're going to try to pick it up on our end. So we want to have fun. And we want to enjoy the story. So, if the, but if the story sucks, we'll, we'll we'll speed it along. That's what I'm trying to say. Stop there. Present your travel permits. Sorry, but we really gotta get to Narakami Island. It's kind of urgent. If you don't have a travel permit, this is as far as you'll get. Those are the rules. Like, I'm interested. I'm interested in learning about the politics. And the tax policy of Liyue, or not Liyue, Inazuma. Uh, like, I'm actually really interested in all the politics of this region. But I don't want it to be, I don't want it to be explained to me by an NPC. You know? It needs to be, like, an important character. Right? Somebody that I, somebody that I care about. We, like, we, we arrived in Inazuma. And then they're instantly like, here's why you should care about this foreign merchant's, like, tax problems. I'm like, I don't know this, dude. I don't care. <sighs> As expected. Traveler, you got to think of something. How do we get out of Rito? I wonder if the Kanjo Commission has heard of us. In, yeah, in on Tuesday stream, folks explained to me the factions. I know that there's who's can someone hit a hot refresher of the commissions once again? Are you saying we should go and meet with the Kanjo Commissioner? I've seen streamers use boring, soulless dialogue quests as just chatting. That's yes, that's my right idea. That's he really what I'm trying to say. Has a few choice words to say about his subordinates. Who knows? Maybe he's our biggest fan. <laughs> if it's dragon, if NPCs are yapping, you know we're gonna yap too. Go to the Kanjo Commissioner's office to act about ask about a way to leave Rito. Yashira is Toma. Ayaka, Ayato, Cultural and Festivals. Okay, so the Cultural Department. Okay, good to know. 
Royal Bookerly is the lore master, by the way, around here. Hanjo, we haven't met them yet. They are the finance bros. Well, let's go talk to them. Let's go. Let's go meet them. Halt! This is the Kanjo Commissioner's office. No trespassers. We're here to see, uh, you know, uh, the Kanjo Commissioner. Henryo, military, closest to the Shogun. In a couple characters you meet later. Sounds good. Thank you for the info. The I really appreciate you. seldom entertains Outlanders. Leave now, or we'll be forced to. Ah, wait, wait, wait. Oh, Commissioner. These Take. two are honored guests from afar. No need to give them the usual spiel. Hmm. Come on in. Let's see what we can do for you. Huh. Did you get all that, mister? Like, m my sincere apologies. Just, be character is an, just because a character is an NPC, right? That doesn't mean that I'm immediately, like, not interested in what they say. Like, I, I'm going to give everybody a free shake, right? Like, when somebody appears on the screen, like, I want to hear your story. But if we've heard you talk like multiple times and you're like not saying anything, it's like, like come on, dude. I am Hiragi Shinsuke, Kanjo Commissioner and head of the Hiragi Clan. Hello, please. It's an honor to meet you both. Hey there. Nice to meet you, sir. So the reason we wanted to come and see you was because. All right, all right, all in good time. Two travelers renowned far and wide have shown up to see me. <laughs> so what you're saying is we really are pretty famous, huh? Absolutely. Like that dude's line. I could read How it in his head. We didn't need to sit and listen to him say like, it takes to knock the they've come to see me. Storm Terror's sails and put the overlord of the vortex back under the sea, eh? Exactly. Paimon thinks you make an excellent point. And... I hear you also foiled a Fatui plot in Liyue we did. Harbor. We did. Even beat one of their harbingers in a duel. Is that true? Childa. Who, who here in chat is a Childa fan? Yep, it's true, all right. I like, I, I don't get it. As I thought. Something wrong? <laughs> no, no, no. I'm simply awestruck by you both is all. Why do you hate him? Fleshing the story a little bit with unimportant NPCs. Yeah, they gotta, they gotta, it's gotta be a little thick, right? You gotta, they gotta beef it up. You're too kind. For legal. Rito is Ross. greatly honored to have you visit us. One other thing I heard <laughs> about you is your great zeal for helping other people. Kind of mid? Chada is kind of mid? Makes me wonder. I, yeah, I thought he was kind of just generic. So kind as to render your assistance to the Kondro Commission. So I can sure, get no get off the problem. island, dude. Whatever you need, right? Time to run some errands again. Oh, I'm great at running errands. Excellent. Well then, you must know the Qingxian. A flower grows on the mountain tops of Liyue. I do actually. I'm actually. I actually am familiar with that. Yeah. He gets better yeah, longer on. Let's go. Singson, would you? Freshly picked, I mean. Three hundred. Uh, did Paimon hear that wrong? I think they like him because of personality. His story quest gives a lot of info about him. Interesting. Well, we will we will definitely check out his story quest when it comes along. Actually, we I have to use a key to get into his story quest. I'm probably not going to get in his key. Hmm. Too much trouble, is it? Hmm, I see. Then how about this? We have a few items that need delivering. Perhaps you can help with that? that sure, I'll take right your stuff wherever you want it. 709 letters to be precise. Hey, what? what gives? How come you don't have people to do that already? Terribly sorry. We're just a little short on people lately. Hello, oh, please, Sonny. How are you what doing today? Sort of an explanation is that? Who's this? Wait, who's this? Wait, who is that? Traveler, what are we going to do? Should we really help this guy? Yeah. That's the spirit. Who is that? Who's Don't pretty pretty woman? Who is that? Now. <laughs> you one story key for story hey, quest? Yes. So I'm probably not going to spend mine on child. Uh, I'm probably not. I'm probably not going to do it.
get to know her very soon let's go she i i might i feel like i might have recognized her i feel like i maybe i maybe recognized her maybe just as i expected actually i didn't expect that i saw that coming huh? what did we do miss hiragi has a letter for you she insists that you read it immediately okay So this means she wants you to secretly meet her at night? But you didn't seem Whoa. surprised at all by this. What's going on? We shared a glance. Why? Look at Lumine. Why is Lumine so smug? Lumine's like, that woman was hitting on me. We, she gave me the look and now she sent me a message. Huh? Have you been up to something behind Paimon's back? A little, a little look, Let's see. Ask her tonight and see what she has to say. Between two women. Pama wouldn't understand. Yeah, Lumine, Lumine's smug. Lumine, she knows she cooked, right? <laughs> she knows she's slick. Uh, okay. Meet at the appointed time. Lumine, ever since Lumine called Paimon emergency food, she's been smug. Smug as hell. She really has been. I, I like it, though. Like, I'm here for it. I like it. I like Lumine. She's pretty cool. Lumine gives you lesbian vibes. Vibes. Lumine lesbian. A little bit. I, dude. Okay, so I think to bring it, I'm gonna I'm gonna pop over to Honkai Star Rail Zone for a little bit. So spoilers for a slight. I'm not gonna outright spoil it. But suggestive themes for Honkai Star Rail 2.0, right? Uh, I think people who played as the male character, the MC, Kalis, thought that that was a date. And it feels like a lot of people who play as the femme MC in Honkai Star Rail thought that it was not a date, that it was just friends. And I don't know if that's because lesbians are oblivious or as as common as is commonly known you know have you, you all seen the memes it's like women women will move in each move in with each other and kiss each other each day and they won't realize they're dating right like is it is it like a is it like a girl's thing or is it like a i don't, I don't know it feels like it feels like the players of the different mcs had different opinions on the matter her brother gives gay vibes. Aether gives you gay vibes. I think it's I think it's because I don't know. I feel like I feel like characters are written to be pretty respectful. You know, I think all the characters are just like I just don't I don't think that they'd be. I don't know. It's a, it's an interesting thought. Have a good one, Dawn. I hope you have a very very good night. Have a good sleep, okay? When you kiss the homies, society calls you gay. No, you have to kiss the homies. It's it's legally required. Ah, it's the law. You finally arrived. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Hiragi Chisato. Hi, Hiragi. This is technically the second time we have met. It's a pleasure to see you again. Wow. She's the daughter of the Hiragi clan, all right. Okay, I'm interested to meet her. I'm interested to meet her. You thought it was a date, Yakuara? Dang it. I didn't think it was a date. <laughs> yeah, anybody can kiss, regardless of how you identify, you can kiss the homies goodnight. The pleasure is ours to meet the daughter of the Hiragi clan. No need to be so Hiragi. I've oh, her name's Chisato. And at last, we have the chance to meet. Her last name is first, I see. I was about to say, like, her name is Hiragi Hiragi? The reason why I wanted to secretly meet you here is, well, I feared that I might never have another opportunity to discuss this with you. Okay. Discuss what? Uh, um, I should like to ask for your help with delivering a letter. Why does everybody want me to deliver everything? Ugh, like father, like daughter. Couldn't you be more original? No, you misunderstand me. Please. Allow me to explain. I was hoping that you could deliver a letter to Narukami Island in my stead. It is to be given Wait. to Kujo Kamachi of the Tenryo Commission. 
This is how we get off Rito. He's forbidden me from communicating with him. He knows that there are prospects for my marriage that would better serve him politically. Romeo and Juliet. But my heart is with Kamaji. There is no one who would dare defy my father's will on Rito, but you are outlanders. Outlanders seeking to get to Narukami Island. It would be regrettable to let such an opportunity pass. Oh, Paimon gets the whole picture now. Shizato and Raiden Shogun have the same VA? I see that's what I thought it was. I thought that and don't tell me if I'm right, but Chisato instantly reminded me of Raiden Shogun. Inazuma and Liwei use the same naming system as real world Japan and China. That makes a lot of sense. Of course, in doing so, that always I throws me off. Everything in my power to help you leave Rito. That is my promise. I had yo, I had a friend. I had I had a person that I was like mutuals with on There was some okay there was a person that I was mutuals with on Twitter, right? There, it was and this person would come into the stream, right? And they'd be like Hi Osiria Hi Osiria and I'm like I'm Rob and and like no matter what I would say, they would always come into the stream and they would just be like Hi Osiria What's up, Osiria? And I, I like unfollowed them. I was just like, I was just like, this is weird. I, 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 I thought it was a little weird. I recognized that they were probably just like, I don't know. I thought, I thought it was strange. It, I, yeah, it was funny. It was, it was, it was okay. It was cool, but it was, I was like, I, I caught, a, I caught a weird vibe. I was like, I've asked you to call me Rob, and a couple times. You know, it's. Uh, I think that I'm gonna call you this way. It's like mm, I don't think that you will actually. <laughs> Sounds good. Thank you for lurking, heavy robot. I appreciate you. What's up, mom? She, how you doing? I will do everything in my power to help you leave Rito. Sounds like a reasonable deal. To be perfectly deal. honest, as long as you remain in Inazuma, my father will have no intention of letting you leave Rito. What's up, V? How yeah, are you doing today? We figured as much. It was pretty obvious he was just trying to hold us up here. I secretly overheard a conversation between my father and a very arrogant sounding woman just a few days ago. They seemed to be discussing how to keep you here on Rito. Whoa. In fact, it was the first time I had ever heard my father speak so respectfully to someone who wasn't the Shogun. Who do they mean by an arrogant sounding woman? We don't have much time. I'll tell you my plans to help you off the island. It just so happens that a shipment of goods is. Who was the Very person well. they were talking I'll be to, waiting though? For you at the border. I'm counting on you to deliver my letter. Names are not something you freestyle. Yeah, unless see, unless you don't care how people pronounce it or or anything like i have there's a, another person that i watch right and they don't care how their they don't care how their name is pronounced and i was like that's i don't understand it that doesn't make any sense to me thank you so much for subscribing on youtube please feel free to say hello please and introduce yourself or continue lurking folks i think hold on i have to check something i had to check something real quick real 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 quick do 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 folks we hit 1,700 subscribers on YouTube. Oh my God, goodness. We hit 1,700 subscribers on YouTube. So thank you all so, so, so much for your support. I really, really, really appreciate you. Yippee! Yippee! Yippee, yippee. So thank you so much. I really appreciate you. Let's go. Poggers? Poggers? <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate everybody so much. I sure do. Check out my... Watch my Acheron reaction. Watch the Acheron reaction over on YouTube. I need a couple more views. Please. I'm starving out here. Don't let me flop, bros. Don't let me flop. Hold on, please. <laughs> These goods are being sent to Watatsumi Island? My lady. Thank you, everybody. I appreciate honor. you. Uh, you are correct. These goods have been repeatedly requested by the Kanjo Commissioner. We must be certain that they reach Watatsumi Island intact. 
Is there something wrong, Lady Hiragi? No, as you were. My father simply has some concerns of the shipment's safety, and has ordered that myself and an additional qualified escort be dispatched to ensure safe transport of the goods. Not a thought behind Lumine's eyes. Not a single one. Do you see that? That, it's so blank. Her eyes, there's not a thought behind that soul. Not even a little bit. My lady, you aren't suggesting that you intend to escort this shipment personally, are you? There's certainly no need for you to trouble yourself with such a matter. And What's between the mirrors is nothing. Qualified escort. You dare question my abilities? Please, do not cause us any further delay. If memory serves me right, my father has already asserted that this shipment must arrive on time. I'm certain punishment will be duly dispensed if it fails to do so. Yes, of course, my lady. It, it's just that, well, we don't know who this... Now, need I remind you of the penalty if anything were to happen to me en route? I'm sure you are all quite familiar with my father's temperament. Yeah. Do you really presume that you can fully guarantee my safety on your own? Boy. That's what I'm here for. Yeah, dude, she's she's that. cooking. They don't stand a chance. Uh, uh, yes, my lady. Very well then. It, it's an honor to have you accompanying us. Your safety is our highest priority. Shinojo. You can't really be agreeing to this. Well, the request is from Lady Hiragi herself. It is our duty to serve her in the utmost capacity. Yes, but that's not the problem here. Well then, if we're through here, I suggest we set off at once. Dawdling will only allow potential thieves more time to prepare, no? Yes, my lady. You heard her. There's no time to lose. You want Lumina as your lawyer? You want her as your lawyer? She seems pretty cool. We didn't escort the transport. Oh god, it's an escort mission. I didn't know this is exactly what they meant. I didn't know that they were gonna expect an accurate, an actual lady, please stay transport we'll mission. Not as well as we'll handle it. Witness the power of Gugwa. Cut to the chase. Don't blink. I hope you're doing okay, Kitsune. Gosh. The wrong test subject. There's no end to this. Share my knowledge. Oh. Incoming. Monster sighted. Prepare to counterattack. Protect Lady Hiraki at all costs. We'll take care of this. Stay with Chisato. Oh, the day that I realized you can just do that without having to scan everybody, but the, okay, that's the one thing I kind of, I low-key don't like about Nahida's gameplay, okay? I love Nahida, she's my little bean, but I don't like having to scan everybody all the time. This sucks. Escort the payload. It is a payload, payload mission. Look at this. Doesn't this look like a payload? Can, the can I sit out on it? <laughs> we can take refuge in the village up ahead. How are you faring, my lady? I'm perfectly all right. You may stop here. The road to Narukami Island is just over there. In my letter, I've requested Kamaji to grant you a special travel permit from the Tenryo Commission. Consider it a token of my appreciation. Thank you, Chisato. My lady. Huh. So that's how it is. I, I had a feeling something was amiss, but Shinojo, you... No, Lady Hiragi would never hide anything from us. I'm sure of it. But who is this Kamaji you speak of, my lady? I'm not afraid to say that... Welcome back, Mom. She... He's the one I love. The He's the one, one that I want. You love? She, I feel like she Shinojo, shouldn't be telling these people did this. You honestly think that? Wait, why is she telling these what? people this? No, I, uh, I was just clarifying. That's all. I, I would never, in my wildest dreams, uh, <clears throat> bro. You do oh, need no. word. Please forget that this ever happened. If my father catches word of it, I alone will be held accountable. Yes, of course, as you wish, my lady. But. 
What will happen if your actions here are discovered, Chisato? Is this this sunrise is beautiful My though? My father has always been one to spoil me. The worst he'd do is sentence me to half a day without food or something to that effect. Huh. Paimon never suspected a guy like him could have a soft side. I know he got sure owned. Poor guy. Journey. Poor fella. I'm sure we will meet again. Bye, Chisato. Half a day is kind of long, though. It Come it kind of is, right? You're staring, and let's get moving. We've got goods to shift. <laughs> he's he's frozen. He's heartbroken. He's frozen. Uh, all right. <laughs> Thank you for watching, Evil Cat. Did you check out the video? I really, really, really appreciate you. I really, really, really appreciate you. That I that helps a lot. Thank you. Okay, we completed that. We completed the Rito escort mission. Again. I thought there was like a five minute timer. I, I thought we were gonna have to. I thought we were gonna have to. Do wait, whoa. Wait, is this freedom? Freedom. Freedom is mine. I hear the wind. <laughs> Um, is this the whole Inazuma? There's no way this is the whole Inazuma region, right? Look how much, yeah, look how much stuff there is to unlock on the map. Have you used the Genshin boats before? I don't think that I have. I don't think that I have. I've never, I've never had before. This is just the city. I've sneezed. Used to get used to using wave riders. They will be your main form of transport. Wait, did I did I uh, did I sneeze? Did I sneeze on the? Uh, did I sneeze on the? Did I? Did I did. Uh, I I try I try not to sneeze on the microphone. <laughs> Have a good night, Yako Ara. Take it easy. Have a good sleep. Evil Cat, if you're going to head out, I really, really hope you have a good sleep too. And thank you so much for watching my Akira video. I really, really appreciate you. Folks, I know I know what I did in the last couple videos. I know I can fix it for next time. Are these world quests that are around? Are we supposed to be picking up world quests? Or do we... Oh, we want to travel on down to the city. Yeah, we want to travel on down to the city. I don't want to pick up the world quest right now. I want to continue the Archon quest. Let's see the world. Let's see the place. Is this? Oh, I want to. I want to look at the map real quick. So we were in Rito, and she let us get across to the mainland. Let's go. Hello, Sweezy Doodles. Hello, Bean OCE. How are y'all doing today? You see a massive spiral in the sky? Not that I can see. Oh, there it is. Is that is that the massive spiral you see? You're talking about? Sakura cleansing world quest was top tier. Yo, I might have to check that one out. I might have to check that one out. Not purple enough? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Kamiya, I gotta ask. Remember, folks, we have a strict no spoiler policy, folks. So please don't please don't mention future plot points of the game. You're good so far, but I we might be getting we're getting a little close, okay? I just want a gentle reminder. The folks. Gentle reminder. Not bad, as far as treasure is concerned. Do 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 do. Shingsho has his new outfit on. Yes, I did get a new outfit for Shingsho. Wait, what is this, bro? Is this a boss? What does bro want? This is like a world boss. Oh, what a chump. Mini boss who gives a chest. I like that. You receive. I like that. Let's keep going. Just with the drama? He scared me. He scared me. For sure. I was I saw the 
It was it was a Dark Souls moment, right? You see the health bar pop up and you're like, huh? You're like, huh? Where? Who? What? Where? When? Viewpoint? I wish there was a point to... I wish there was a place where you could access... I like. I wish I could download those viewpoints. The kid? The kid's world quest? There's the interactive map. The interactive map. I still haven't had a chance to check out the interactive map. Press menu and the viewpoints are in archive. Yeah, but I wish I could like, I wish I could like download them. Right? I don't even see that there's like, I, I, I can't even see like, a, is there a resource for this online? Like, I would love to download this and use this as like a YouTube thumbnail. Right? Actually, I think that the Genshin Impact Wiki does do this. Let's see if I can recognize, let's see if I can recognize my, any of my thumbnails. Oh yeah, I think the Genshin, Genshin Wikipedia, it definitely feel, uh, maybe, maybe they do have them up there, but I've been, I've been looking for them and I've never, I haven't been able to find them. Hi Jugular, welcome, welcome, how are you doing today? Welcome, welcome, hello please. Get a camera and take your own pictures? Yes, but I like but the ones that they take are really are are really really good. According to the letter, this should be the place. Sorry, we don't serve the general public. Whoa. I'm afraid you'll have to leave. Wait, we're not the general public. Well then, you must be a couple of wandering outlanders that snuck into the nation, judging by your attire. <gasps> Are our clothes really so... Uh, oh, uh, what Paima means to say is... The tea house? Wait, what, what's the tea house? Hmm... The Yashiro Commission seal. This must be from Mr. Toma. It seems there's more to you than meets the eye. In which case, welcome to the Komore Tea House, a safe haven for the Yashiro Commission. Hi, Camo. How are you doing today? Well, that oh, please. Sounds more like it. Hmm. This is the this is the tea house. I'm excited. I'm excited to see what it see, when we arrived. It looked like it feels like folks got excited. I'm excited to see what's. I'm, I'm excited. I'm excited to see what's cool Hello. about it. Now that we're here, where's Toma? Oh, Hyman doesn't see him anywhere. Do you think he forgot his promise to meet us? Who forgot their promise? I was beginning to think you'd forgotten about me. What? Is Toma a dog? Bro, what is? Woof woof what is he woofing about? What? Is that dog talking to us? <laughs> Relax. No need to look so surprised. I take it this is the first time you've seen me in this form? Huh. So you didn't see anything like this when you were in Leo Harbor? Ah, oh, now that you mention it, this does suddenly seem less out of the ordinary. <laughs> it doesn't really I, I know a dog when I see him. See one. That's clearly a Feline, a, a, cat, a dog. Why did I say cat? Right, That's a dog. Right. Wait. Oh. Fun. Oh. Hey, you're this close to getting an ugly nickname, Mister. Sneaky, sneaky. <laughs> well, I've had some time to kill, given that I've been waiting here for you for so long, as was the case in Rito. So I came up with this little fun greeting for when you arrived. But in all seriousness, I would like to apologize about that little test you went through earlier. Though it was quite necessary. Why? Why was it, it necessary? Helped us determine whether or not to bring you before Miss Kamisato. Okay. And whether you had the courage to face the lightning alongside us. Okay. Hmm. Don't think that Paimon's gonna forgive you just because you're getting all serious now. 
<laughs> Sorry, did I overdo it? My apologies. How do we do in our test? Let me just say this. You've often found yourself skirting the rules from the very beginning, haven't you? Oh, yeah. Naturally, this is due to your unwavering and resolute determination. A long time ago, we had a friend who was much the same. But when the lightning struck... You mean Kazuha's friend? Ah, so you've heard of his story. Hmm. I have. We watched, we watched the animation. It was good. His light still burns all the more brightly. Will we be allowed to meet the Shirasagi? Himegimi? Yes, of course. I will bring you to the Kamisato residence where the Yashiro Commission is located. But before that, there Ooh, was one other be place I was hoping you both would accompany <laughs> me to. Oh? Where? I would like you to come with me to the statue of the omnipresent god. It's still under construction now, but you can already see it from practically anywhere on Narukami Island. What the dog doing? Bro, what the dog doing? Okay, I was I didn't I didn't consider the fact that he could be like crouching behind here to be a possibility whatsoever. I didn't I didn't consider that to be a possibility whatsoever. <laughs> we is it outside? Do we need to go outside? Right? The dog be dogging. They do what the dog doing. They do be they do be dogging around. Yeah, we gotta go. We gotta go out here. We're gonna go to the statue of the omnipresent God. There's a chest behind the dog. Let's go see. Let's go see. Let's go see. Wow, big chest. Hello, please crazy. How you doing today? Welcome, welcome. Hello, please. Yeah, I like Mora. I like, give me the cheddar, okay? <laughs> give me the green. Bye-bye, Kamiya. Bye-bye, Infinity Kitsune. I hope you both have a wonderful day. Take it easy, okay? Did I get the Mora chest in the Leoe bank? I did not. And I'm probably not going back for it at this time either. Was that chest big or is she just small? Yes. All of the above. All of the, all of the above, I would say. <laughs> uh, Low-key, I don't care about chests in this game at all. Yeah, I don't care about chests in this game at all. Wait, what's going on with the statue? Visions? You mean all the visions that are collected from the Vision Hunt Decree are put into the statue? So you've already heard of the Vision Hunt Decree. Why did the Shogun issue the Vision Hunt Decree? Before I try to explain, I should perhaps remind you first that Mondstadt is the city of freedom, and Leo is the city of contracts. Who are we? As for Inazuma, it's known as the Nation of Eternity. The Raiden Shogun is both the nation's most powerful ruler and its deity. The eternity in question is her endless and unchanging will to rule over Inazuma. Yo, As such, little power she relies on the Tri Commission to regulate the nation's affairs and the Sokoku Decree to limit the people's movement. Yo. The Shogun wishes to keep Inazuma in stasis, allowing the stream of time to flow from one end to the other without disturbing it for all time. Hi, Derek. How are you doing today? The month since you played Genshin, I think you got past the first island. Give it another try. It's pretty fun. Chests are pretty important. I, I don't know. Exploration. It's not. It's not my thing. It's not for me. I don't like it. I'm playing Genshin despite it being an open world game. Like all the exploration and stuff is a negative for me. Seems like every god has their own will. 
Of course, this is my own limited understanding. As for the reason behind the recent Vision Hunt decree, perhaps the Shogun believes that visions grant people the power to change, and that her eternity doesn't allow for such instability to exist. Whatever the case, the fact is that the Raiden Shogun has dispatched the Tenryo Commission to scour the nation for visions, embedding each one in this statue. Yeah, I pretty much, I'm really playing the game for the story and for the characters. The actual gameplay, I, I could take or leave. TBH, like just like 100% TBH. Like I like to pull characters, I like to pull, I like to pull characters, I like to build characters. Um, But like the actual like gameplay, I don't, it's not, it's not really my favorite one. Yeah, 80 common chests for one pull, it's like, I, I have a credit card. <laughs> and this statue of the omnipresent thank you so much for the follow up seen as inazuma's symbol of eternity thank you so much for the follow i will hope you welcome welcome on in thank you so much for being here i appreciate you good to meet you but if that's the case wouldn't you say that the raiden shogun is being oh i don't know selfish <laughs> only outlanders such as yourselves would ever dare speak out so directly against the raiden shogun and yet i agree the Vision Hunt Decree is something that simply should not exist. And Miss Kamisato has been committed to fighting it since the day it was announced. Hello, please. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome on in. Please feel free to introduce yourself and say hello, please, or continue lurking. Welcome in. I appreciate you. Hi, Brooke. How are you doing today? Welcome on in. Whoa. whoa, whoa. Freaky stuff. That was my, literally my huh? face. That was crazy. Welcome in, Mobbin. How are you doing today? Sound. Hello, please. What sound? I didn't hear anything. Did something happen? Yeah, you touched the statue, and then... And then what? I can hear the sound of people's... Aspirations? That's not what I would describe. That was, uh... That looked, that looked horrifying. Aspirations are like people's dreams, their hopes for the future. And that, that seems scary to me. I don't know what that was. Aspirations? Yeah, that, that was crazy. That would seem to confirm the saying. Sounds good, Cray. Welcome on in. Mabin's doing good. We're doing good, too. We are having a great, great day so far. And we're enjoying Inazuma our conquest today. We're having a lot of fun so far. Thank you, everybody, for being here. I appreciate you. But you could try Genshin Foods. Isn't there, like, a Genshin Impact, like, uh cookbook that exists we do we got to try some of that when an adeptus temptation irl chat what kind of adepti would you be if you were an adeptus what kind of adepti would you be that's why i'm pissed at mountain carver right he's totally he totally stole my deal because i would totally be a deer adepti and then mountain carver comes along and did my my whole thing Have already it before that when a person's ambition reaches a certain strength, the gods look upon them with favor. That is where visions come from. In other words, a person's vision represents their ambition. So if what you've just said is true, whoever does a cooking show with recipes, we have to see it. We have to check it out. Then the ambitions of these people are stronger than I imagined. So a vision symbolizes ambition, not power. Okay, this seems, wait, this seems like a, the vision decree. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I have, to, I have to focus for a sec. I have to focus. I feel like this is important. The Vision Decree. Biden Shogun has issued the Vision Decree, but a vision symbolizes ambition and not power. So, she doesn't want people to start thinking that maybe they have the potential to rule Inazuma instead of her one day. Am I am I cooking? Am I getting closer? All right. Time for the next stop on our tour of Narukami Island, the Kamisato residence. Let's go. <sighs> Finally. Imagine losing 250-50 out of 7 which you wanted to lose. The 50-50? What what how does that work? What what banner did you want to lose on? The visions are given through ambition, which is another word for determination, which means frisk Undertale. Visions follow the other Archon's mortals. So I'm somewhat there. Okay, so I'm I'm starting to cook. We're starting we're starting to understand. 
Okay, we're start we're starting to put it all together. We have to say the good old days. The good old days never end. That's a good way. That's a good way to look at things. Your adeptus name would be Dune Arrow Dare. That kind of that kind of fits. You have no idea why she hates vision so much. I think she doesn't enjoy visions because it's simple people people that's that's what I'm saying, right? Raiden, Raiden Shogun might not enjoy visions because visions come from people's ambitions. And she doesn't want people to have ambitions or dreams of a different future. She wants to control the future and control the country of Inazuma. You see what I'm saying? That's why that's why it makes sense for her to dislike vision. You see what I'm saying? That's what I'm saying. That's what that's what I think. That's what I think is happening. How the heck do I get over there? Okay, I gotta go. Okay, I gotta go back this way. <laughs> There's a theory that characters in the same element share similar values and traits. That makes sense. I think that that makes sense for sure. I like the music of Inazuma so far. It's pretty chill. So far, Inazuma is really pretty. This reminds me, I don't know if anybody ever played World of Warcraft, but this reminds me of Outland. You know, the like space region. Outland in World of Warcraft is known for having like really beautiful, luscious, blue green like forest areas like this too. But just like this, you look up and you see the floating islands, the purple electric magic and stuff it's uh it's super cool why are y'all so nice i am so 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 proud of our community i think we i think everybody here is really really proud of our community everybody here is really really nice and cool if you're like not nice and cool right you're probably not in this community anymore so everybody's really 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 sweet i'm really i'm really proud of everything that we have accomplished together so far our community is really, really cool. I would like to be here. Even if I wasn't the streamer, I would like to be here. My heart would be a butterfly. Adeptus. But okay, but not not like who, not like what would you, left over would you take? Like if you could be anything, what would it be? Like I would be a deer adeptus. So I say, heck you mountain carver because i also want to be a deer adeptus so like if you could be anybody who, who would it be who would you be where's that waterfall noise coming from they're right here yeah there it is yeah we're we're pretty chill here we we're not like like people you can simp here right like there there I, I i subscribe to the theory that there are times to simp and there are times to be say so say so meaning wholesome friendly the water is spicy oh shit it is Wait, get the ajita out of the spicy water. Oh, no, no, no. We gotta go. <laughs> Hello, please. Arkans, how are you doing today? Hello, please. Look, I'm just a little robin. I don't know what's going on.
Sad. Sad, 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 sad. But by Nahida. Well, she's back. Okay, it's not so bad. It's not so bad. Okay, it's not so bad. Look, it's not so bad. <laughs> Welcome in Arkansas. It's very good to see you. A little bit of salmon is holding a little too much. Yeah. It's a. Uh, we tried so hard. We got so far. But in the end. It doesn't even matter. What did I see? I saw that Nahida was about to fall. She was about to fall and uh, she wasn't going to make it. Oh, this isn't going to work either. Wait, do you think I can make it over there? Yeah, I can make it over there. Yeah, right? Yeah, right? Yeah, I totally can. No, I'm 100% confident. I can make it to this ledge. For sure. Right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We're good. We're totally good. Look, we're totally good. See? We're totally good. <laughs> Let's go. Yippee. Yeah, we got it. We got this. We got this. Run our way out. We're making that out of the spicy water pool with this one. We're making it out of the spicy water pool. Am I playing with keyboard? Uh, am I playing with a controller today? I am. I am. I like to play. Um, I like to play with a controller because it makes it easier for me to like turn in my chair. And look around at all the stuff that I need to see while I stream. Hello, please, Antark. How are you doing today? Grab the Naku weed. Struggling with controller? I think controllers. I think controllers pretty comfy. I think playing on mouse and keyboard is more. Fun, but for me, streaming mouse and keyboard works really, really well for me. It it just like it works really well for me. Oh, I don't want to do that. Uh, no. Does anyone try playing Ganyu with controller? Ganyu is like a bow and arrow character, right? Yeah, I just think it's more. I just think it's more comfortable to play with a controller but that's just personal personal preference i'm trying to get away from as like i don't know recently i've i've become less like uh recently i have been like i've been trying i haven't enjoyed the sensation of being like hunched over my keyboard right like I, i'm not i'm not i'm not a big fan of that it's okay estella it's okay Everything's okay. This is the kind of place where the big shots of Inazuma live, huh? Hmm. Paimon kind of expected it to be snazzier. It's hard, yeah, it's hard to top the Jade Chamber. I didn't even realize that the Dawn Winery was like a good place. Like, I didn't I wasn't impressed by the Dawn Winery at all, but the Jade Chamber, god, I love the Jade Chamber. Welcome at last to the Kamisato residence, honored guests. Miss Kamisato was delighted to finally meet you. Let's get going. Let's see how it is. Shirasage Himigimi you keep going on about? So, uh, where is she at? Thank you for lurking, Alyssa. I appreciate you. <clears throat> oh, uh, behind the screen? I wonder, is this going to be a character that I recognize? Do you think this is like a alias or something? Like, what is this? Yes. <laughs> As the daughter of the Yashiro Commission, this is how Miss Kamisato is accustomed to receiving guests. I bet that's Raiden Shogun that behind the screen. Tradition within the Yashiro Commission. Forgive me if this is an unwelcome surprise. It's a little anticlimactic. Mm, makes sense. She's a super important person after all. Please forgive my lack of courtesy for receiving you in this fashion, especially following such a long and wearisome journey over the sea. I miss your welcome, welcome. Don't worry about it. Welcome in today. How you doing today? I have awaited your arrival with great anticipation. 
and Toma assures me that you do indeed possess the power to change the tide of the times. Ayaka? Yeah, I've heard this. I've heard this name before. I have heard this name before. This is the character that was on like 47. She was on Banner for like 47 years, right? People had children and sent them off to college before Ayaka left the Banner. At present in Inazuma, in the name of the Vision Hunt Decree, the people's aspirations are being senselessly trampled underfoot. Though the Yashiro Commission serves the Shogun, it is the people with whom we share close bonds, given the contact we are required to have with them in the performance of our duties. That's why Ayaka is notorious. Why Ayaka is notorious. Yeah, I, I recognize her for that circumstance. I don't know what her character looks like or anything. Um, maybe we'll see. She's hiding behind uh, the, the, the barrier right now. <laughs> the commission's power rises and falls with the trust of their people. Thus, we cannot remain indifferent to this situation without also remaining indifferent to our own fate. Genshin Impact giving away free Ayaka for anniversary. Wouldn't that be funny as hell? Traveler, lend us your power and we can... I'm just here to meet the Raiden Shogun. Seriously, I arrived in Inazuma and I want to meet Mommy Raiden Shogun, please. See, my lady, it's just like I said. This Lu will take us nowhere. Lumine's sick of everybody's nonsense, right? I'm, I'm with Lumine. No, please, wait, please, don't go. <sighs> I, I, I didn't sign up for all this. I will introduce you to the Raiden Shogun on one condition. You must fulfill three small wishes on my behalf. What are your wishes? Travo is like sick and tired of saving the world, bro. Let me save my sibling. It's that's so funny because we did see our sibling and then we were just like, all right, I'm back on my quest. I'm back on my, I'm back on my business. They pertain to three whose visions were taken from them. Perhaps once you've met them, you will understand. Right. I guess. Okay. I guess that's where, I guess that's where I'm having a little bit of trouble connecting to the story of Genshin Impact right now is because while I wasn't like super, super invested in the I need to save my brother storyline, I wasn't like super, super invested in that storyline, but I thought it was a nice like human like connection to ground the story in reality, right? Like how every like how every Pokemon, like how every episode of Pokemon, right, is backdropped against the overall arcing goal, right? that Ash Ketchum wants to become the Pokemon champion, right? Like, that is the big overarching goal. Like, maybe in this episode we're fighting Team Rocket, but one day we're going to be the Pokemon champion, right? And so that's kind of what finding your brother was like for me and Genshin. And we found him, and we talked to him, and it doesn't feel like anything changed. Like... Lumine and Paimon were just like, okay, well, I guess we're still on to Inazuma. Like, it doesn't feel like our objectives change. It doesn't feel like anything changed in the story. So I'm kind of, I'm kind of confused. I'm like, why are we, what are we doing this for? What's, what's the idea here? Like, actually, what is our objective in Inazuma now? Like, why, why are we here? What are we doing here now? A warrior who guards a village, a former samurai who helped carry out the Vision Hunt Decree, and a swordmaster determined to become the best in the world. Does Paimon get that right? I like that she's trying to guilt trip us so we help her. Yeah, I don't like that at all. Correct. Please do all you can to help them. I will await your return here. This is a tall order. What is, like, what is the meaning of all this? <laughs> then... You have my gratitude. <laughs> I'm sure you'll do great. No worries, Miss or Simpleton. I really appreciate you popping in and say hi. I really, really appreciate everybody. Whoever, if you're chatting, if you're lurking, if you're listening, hanging out, just stop in to say hello, please. You know, I, I really, really appreciate everybody. I hope, I hope everybody's having a good day. Whoa, we just instantly spawned and went into a quest? Yo, 
why are you doing this? Why leave all of a sudden, after all these years? Precisely. It's much too sudden. We've had no time to prepare. Hello, please. The children are desperate for you to take them out to play. Please, we urge you to reconsider. That must be the guy Ayaka told us about. Let's go over and see. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's see. And hydrate. Hydration is good. I like hydration. The traveler wants to speak with the seven because they are like the most likely to know what's the deal with the abyss. That's why the traveler is traveling. Okay, thank you, Arkans. You put me right back on the path. So even though that we've met our brother and we know what's going on with him, we still want the seven to tell us exactly what's really going on. We want the full picture, the full information from the seven. I get it. All right, I'm back. I'm, I'm back on the. I'm back on the train. It's still. I think I still don't like the story twist. Right. I think it was a. I don't enjoy the direction that that story is taking. Um, but I. But I understand. Have a good night, iHeartRadio. I hope you have a good EP EP EP. And thank you for hanging out with us today. I will. I will be checking out the uh, ASMR. Surprised that none of the Archons knew about our twin. Did you really? Were you really? I don't know. I wouldn't. Uh, I wouldn't know that. Like, uh... if you want, it's clear that I can't claim truth be told. I didn't know. I didn't know that was going on. Ah, uh, you must all. Tejima has protected this, keeping out the treasure hoarder. But now, we will gladly apo I didn't realize that that was voice dialogue. I was expecting her to say nothing of importance. You must be Tejima. All of a sudden. My bad. Me? I... It's not a question of why I want to leave, but a question of what reason I would have to stay. Yeah, the brother didn't say much. I don't know. I just didn't... I just didn't like it. I just didn't like it. I, don't, I, I didn't like that he popped up and then said, hello, please, and bye-bye, please. I don't like it. Oh, please, sailor. Welcome, welcome. Stop giving you rewards for Genshin Impact. No, you need to install the game. You need to connect your Twitch account to your Hoyoverse account to collect your free Prima Gems just for watching this stream. Your brother says you need to finish your journey in order to understand his path, which reads like he knows something we don't. Okay, I do remember that. I do remember that, but I don't know. I just... I, I don't know. I just don't I don't like that. I don't like that that story turn. I don't like that. I don't like it. I don't like it. True. But that's not why I chose to stay here. I don't like it. Simple as. And what made me want to come here 30 years ago? And why have I never wanted to leave in all that time? I don't have answers to those questions because I can't remember anymore. Ever since they took my vision away, it's like a slice of my memory is gone. In the past, I knew I wanted to stay here. But whatever resolve I had then, it's gone now. Damn. So I thought, what's to stop me from moving around instead? The emptiness inside me will be there either way. I don't think it was a mean cliffhanger. I don't think it was like a cliffhanger. I like a cliffhanger makes you more interested in the future and that that one didn't that was just like uh, it felt like a half measure it felt like a half measure to me thank you so much for subscribing on YouTube please feel free to say hello please and introduce yourself or continue lurking welcome on in I appreciate you you don't like Gogeta evolution I do wait I do like Gogeta evolution you love the new event? You get good photos from it? I did the first part of the new event, but I haven't I haven't completed it. I haven't done parts two or three yet. Okay. Well, in that case, if we help you rediscover the reason you chose to stay, you won't need to leave anymore, right? Hmm. But if you can't remember anything, it's not gonna be easy. Oh, maybe Bro got stuck in his hometown. To I think this happens then. to so many people. <laughs> Not me, but so many people. Oh, that reminds me. 
Last time I brought Tejima some fruit, I do believe I saw him writing in a diary. Is the full event out yet? Genshin likes to release time gated stuff. I know that more than the first part is out now. But I don't know if the full... I Like part two of the event I know is out. But I don't know if part three is out. Yeah, nope. Still a couple days. Still a couple days till part three. Mm, I see, I see, I see. I keep a diary? If you say so. I honestly can't seem to remember. Oh yes, yes you do. And what's more, I remember you saying at the time that you wanted to make a note of a few interesting things. Things Let's go. which would prove very important at a later date. Perfect! So if we want to keep Tejima from leaving, we just need to find his diary. It must Let's be go. around here somewhere. Let's take a look. If you don't mind, we will leave you to find the, the full event is out. Thank we you, Justin Jam. Justin Jam says that the full event the is out. Situation. Welcome in. I hope you're having a good day. We could, yeah, we could check it right here. Let's see. Let's see. I got it right here in front of me. I do need to do this. Oh, yeah. So unlock after all operation cycles in the pre requisite phase so yeah so level three is out i've just i've done level one but i haven't done level two that staff is perfect for yao yao yeah i'm excited i'm gonna i i am gonna i am gonna complete it and i will grab the staff for yao yao i like yao yao a lot i think i think uruguay uruguay here she'll say it look she says the thing Oh, well, it's her ult. But isn't this, isn't this thing so cute? It is a very cute rabbit. <laughs> rabbit guy. Let's, uh, let's. Let's heal up. Radish thrower. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Good, cute, good, cute animal. For sure. You're talking about the one with the domain? Oh, I have, I have no idea. I don't have a clue. I don't have a clue. Okay, let's go back here. See what's going on. Uruguay. That's what I'm going to call it. I know that I'm pronouncing it like the South American country, Uruguay. This looks like Tejima's diary, but that's what right? she sounds like. That's what it sounds like, too. Let's don't you know? What we have here. Today, the village and I got together to cook dried raised salted fish. I messed up and burned mine a little, so I had to pretend that it was black snake head instead. Today, I helped rescue a kid who had fallen in the water. After I pulled him out, he told me that his best friend Bamboo was still in the water. I searched the water the whole afternoon before finding out that Bamboo was the name of his pet crab. I went Bamboo, that's a cute name for a crab. So I chased after it as fast as I could. I soon realized I was never going to get it back. So Wait. I just found somewhere to sit and watch as it flew away into the distance. What is Paimon reading? What's the context here? Hmm. Seems like your average diary of daily village life. Huh? Wait! His journal. That makes a lot of sense. Honestly, this makes a lot of sense. This is this this is the geezer's the geezer guy's journal. It is still my most treasured possession. That makes now, a lot of sense. That's the kind of info we're looking for. Time to pay a visit to the shrine. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. You can't hear its real name anymore. I. Stay put. Let, let's see. Are there voice lines in here? Let's see how she pronounces it. Exactly. Let's see exactly how she pronounces it. About Yao Yao? Where? Oh, you... Spear training is really kind of boring. Maybe I'll go play with Uruguay for a little Uruguay. bit. Uruguay! Come... Uruguay! Isn't that such a funny... Isn't it such a cute name? Uruguay! Uruguay. Where is it? It's the burst skill? Ready? Go! Go get him, Uruguay! Go get him, Uruguay. 
I love I love this voice line. This is so far this is one of my favorite voice lines in the whole game. Go get him, you agree. I love it. It's so cute. Go get him, you agree. So cute. So cute. What a fantastic performance. <laughs> it 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 brings me joy, okay? I I hear it and it brings me joy. I like it. Investigate the shrine near I? Higher? We were just here. Oh, I see. Oh, so I see. This is the Omomori Tejima wrote about. Hmm, interesting. Looking at the color and the design, Paimon would have thought it belonged to a child. But what anyway, is that thing? If he had this with him all the time, there's a chance some of his elemental energy remained on it. Do you think that it might come in handy? Maybe. Uh, use elemental sight to find clues in the diary. Dude, every time the game asks me to use elemental sight, I get so confused. I do. I get so confused. Do we have any, like, elemental sight enjoyers in the house? Like, does anybody really, really enjoy this mechanic? Because I'm going to be so real with you. I don't enjoy this mechanic at all. Here we are. I don't like it. Lot. It reminds me of the the. Did anybody play The Witcher Three? Right, it's like that one thing in The Witcher Three. It's exactly like that one thing in The Witcher Three. I don't remember what the name of the system is, but it's exactly like that one. The way that you find stuff in the world in The Witcher Three. The soil looks like it's been disturbed. Yeah, Witcher Maybe senses. Tejima buried something precious here. Something that kept him in the village all these years. Is, is that what they called it? I don't think that's what they called it. Which witcher senses? I don't think that's exactly what they called it. <laughs> Must be something pretty amazing if it made him stick around for 30 years. Let's dig it up and take a look. You fell asleep at your desk. Have a good Nini Majesty. I hope you have a very, very good sleep. And take it easy. I hope you have a good night. Thanks for hanging around. <gasps> it looks like a letter. The paper's gone yellow. Must have been written a really long time ago. Honda Village. If we become Sounds separated, familiar. where is that place again? If we get separated during the war, go away from me in Konda Village. It'll be a safe home for us there. Yo, let's go. You don't remember it was the last time you used the vision? Ah, so the reason yeah. Hejima came here was to wait for someone. I always forget until it We've like. Been here for thirty years. Oh, guess they didn't show up in the end, huh? I always forget well, until it like Tejima his stuff back and take it from there. I always forget until it's time to pop up that I'm like, wait, 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 what is that? Wait, where do I see that? How do I access that? Okay, let's talk to Tejima. Well, I'll be. That's certainly my handwriting. And I guess the Omamori and letter belong to me too. That is what they called it in Witcher 3? I just I didn't know it was that simple. Hello, please, sarcastic Herla. How are you doing today? Very, very good to see you. There's an elemental vision. Yeah, it's the elemental sight thing. When it like tells you to go look at look for stuff on oh, the world, the elemental vision, whatever, whatever it's called. But I have no memory of anything that's written in this diary. I'm not talking about like the Raiden Shogun vision. I'm talking about the like the way that I see things in the game. Still, vision. Like it's my clear eyeballs. That I was waiting for someone here, and that I chose to wait for thirty years. Over the years, I must have made a note of anything interesting, anything that I could share with her when we were finally reunited. Very cool, Ashras. <sighs> and just look at all the things that did happen over the years. The time has flown by so quickly. Thirty years feels like the blink of an eye. How could I have forgotten something so important to me? You look like. Mm. <laughs> now that I think about it, when my vision was taken from me, it felt like I'd suddenly been hollowed out. That would that makes sense. I would be like hollowed out too. That doesn't. That's crazy. Love, regret. 
everything I felt for her, it's all disappeared. Good night, heavy robot. I hope you have a good night. Have a good sleep. It's early for sarcastic herder. I hope you have a good day. I hope you wake up fully soon. No. I'm doing pretty good not today. Especially. After all, I've forgotten who she was. Her face, her voice, the things we experienced together. I barely recall any of it. That's crazy. It's as if she'd never been in my life to begin with. As if all these years have been nothing but a hazy dream. So do you still plan on leaving? I think maybe not. If this is something I waited most of my life for, I suppose I should carry on waiting. Although, what if she were to turn up eventually? Only to find I didn't remember so much as her name. Ooh, would that be? Wouldn't that be upsetting for her? Ooh, would that be? When I think about it like that, I do feel a slight tinge of sadness in my heart. How curious. Why am I thinking like this when I don't even remember who she is? It's just like that feeling of emptiness. The feeling that something is missing. Wow. <sighs> Thank you both for helping me reconnect with my reason for staying here. No problem, bro. I shall remain here and keep waiting for her. Kejima seems to be dealing okay, but still, it makes Paimon really sad. This option is crazy. Losing a reason to feel sad is maybe the saddest thing of all. Wait, that's crazy. Wait, that's so sad. Seems it's just like Ayaka and Tomo were saying. If you lose your vision, you lose all your hopes and dreams too. That certainly explains the state Tejimo was in earlier. At least we were able to help him, weren't we? Losing 50 to Chichi is right there? Yeah. <laughs> well, let's go find the next person. Yeah, that was a that was a good that ended up being a pretty good story. Misato, I liked that. I liked that. Okay, let's see. Let's see what's up with the, the samurai. Let's see their story. If that story was good, I can't wait to see what the future stories are. Please do not call me Mr. Streamer. I, I appreciate you, but please do, please do not call me that. I don't like that. I've never heard Team Yari before. I haven't, uh, please just call me Robin, okay? I, uh, I haven't heard Team Yari before. I haven't, I haven't met Team Yari. But I know a lot of folks like Team Yari. Should we listen to, should we, okay, now, now I have to know. Now I gotta know. Now I gotta know. Which one of these is the, let's see. Now I got it. No, now I gotta hear it. The old VA or the new voice lines? I want to listen to the new ones because didn't that other dude get fired for some bad? I don't want to participate in that. Let's listen to the new ones. Hi there, I'm Tainari, forest watcher of the Avidia Forest. My duty is to preserve both the rainforest's ecosystem and the safety of its visitors. If this is your first time here, <laughs> I suggest you first peruse the Avidia Forest Survival Guide. I kind of hear particular it. attention to the chapter I hear distinguishing it. between edible and poisonous mushrooms. I kind of I kind of hear it. Between dry sheets of paper, you can I kind of hear it. And hand I don't think I don't think it's a I don't think it's a crazy crazy comparison. I don't think I don't think that's crazy crazy different. We're both honestly we're both like kind of we're both kind of like don't be afraid to make mistakes. It's all part of the learning process. We're, we both have like kind of focus. Like I can just tell that we both talk like kind of with the low like the the front of our face. You know, there are people who talk with like if I like if I talked in my throat, like if I if my voice came from my throat, it would sound like this. If my voice 
mostly came from my head, it would sound like this, right? But I mostly talk, both me and Chinyar, yeah, we talk near our teeth, right? I, 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 can hear, I can hear that similarity for sure. The value of knowledge cannot simply the value be of knowledge cannot simply terms. be quantified in monetary terms. Like we both talk, we place our voice pretty similarly. Hello, please, Queen Lark. How are you doing today? Welcome, welcome. We were we went on a little detour, <laughs> real quick. We went a little detour, real quick. You're doing good. Good to hear. Good to hear. I am doing good, too. I'm doing good too. We uh. Have we finally got into some substance here in Inazuma and so far so good. We're having we're having a fun day today for sure. Let's go. They say the Tenryo Commission is directly controlled by the Shogun. They're the ones responsible for maintaining law and order in Inazuma. The ones actually enforcing the Vision Hunt decree. But why would they take action against one of their own? Conspiracy. Uh, Paimon doesn't get it. Huh? There seems to be some commotion over there. Let's go see what's happening. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's see. I'll ask one more time. Do you intend to withhold this month's emergency provisions? I hope you have a good night, Estella. Thank you so much for hanging out. And I hope you have a good sleep, okay? Take it easy, please. Oh, why now? The entire clan is counting on that food. We demand an explanation. How many times do I have to say it? I don't know anything about emergency provisions. You dare deceive us? Those provisions are essential. Do you understand? Not some goods to be pocketed by greedy samurai. You samurai think you can just do whatever you please? The Tenryo Commission will hear of this. Look, I'm the fixer. Oh my god. Oh my god, Lumine is back with yet another emergency food reference. This is crazy. Oh, huh? And who are you? One of Kurosawa's gang, no doubt. Uh, what? We just happen to be passing by. I think Inazuma is a turning point for Genshin. A lot of things are improved and are improving from here. I'm very, very excited because I know that folks really, really praise Sumeru and Fontaine. But it seems like a, a majority of the fan base, perhaps a majority of the fan base. I don't know. I, I have limited experience, right? But it feels like the, it feels like Inazuma has a lot of folks' opinions split. I like politics and stuff, so like I'm interested to critique the Raiden Shogun. I'm excited to see her methods and see her philosophies. I'm excited to learn about it. I just can't with the NPC yapping, right? Like if we were playing, like if Ayaka was like in front of us, right, and she was telling me, it's like we listen, right? But I have trouble with some of this, some of the NPC stuff. Um, but I'm interested in the plot. Like, I'm interested in the themes that are going on here. And when we, gosh, when we first got to Inazuma, it was brutal. It was brutal, brutal, brutal. We were participating in a scripted martial arts tournament. You know, we got here and learned about tax policy. It, it was a slow start. But now that we made it onto, like, the island of Inazuma proper, I'm, I'm rather enjoying it a lot. Like, the last quest had lots of substance. I liked meeting ayaka kind of um yeah it definitely feels like we got what what are, what are folks saying these days we got motion definitely feels like we're getting some motion underway in your opinion inazuma has strong themes with poor ex execution but they learned they increase the story acts from three to five chapters after inazuma so there's like main main more main story after this certain islands in inazuma got less screen time than it should have yo Yo, I'm excited. I see. You seem to have come just at the right time. Perhaps you can help us settle this matter. I don't know. It's the yeah. I just, I mostly have execution issues right now. Like we we met Kazuha and Beto, and they were pretty cool. I liked Beto more than I liked Kazuha, but it's like we rode over on the ship, and they were like, "Okay, bye bye now," and they left, please. And that was like, okay, so. You know, when we first arrived in Inazuma, I had I had some. I'm still even now. I'm still having trouble connecting a little bit to any of the characters. I need somebody to like grab me and hook me into the story. Butterscotch Bread says more Archon quests the better because easy primos. Hey, 
That's very, very, very true. Oh my gosh. Michaela Sarah lost 20% of your couch. Ouch. Wait, how does that work? Oh, please. Welcome on in. This is Kurosawa. He's a samurai and a member of the Shogun's army. They issue emergency provisions to the area. Oh, I didn't see the island the lost, Ross. responsible for distribution. In the past, we'd simply ask him for provisions and everything would be delivered. Now, he suddenly refuses to give us anything. He's keeping the provisions for himself. I just know it. We'll starve without them. No one seems to care about us. We used to think Kurosawa was a kind man. I get it now, Mikaela. He's shown his true colors. <laughs> He's the same as all the other samurai. Welcome in. How are you doing today? Arkans felt for Inazuma the way I felt about Liyue. So you're see curious to see if I feel the opposite. I'm excited. I'm excited to see. Inazuma is beautiful, but the exploration is so taxing here. I've heard that too. I've heard folks say that they're tired of the mountains of Inazuma. I haven't experienced that yet, but I'm sure that I will. Or perhaps maybe that I may. It's no wonder all the visions have been confiscated. The Raiden Shogun doesn't need people like him helping her rule the nation. Yes, I'm very excited for the Sumeru Archon Quest. I'm very, very, very excited. I started Genshin Impact for Nahida, my little bean Nahida. So I'm very, very excited to see her story. I'm so, so excited to see her story. And then, of course, Fiorina and Fontaine. I'm so excited. Raiden Shogun, very cool character. Like, you know, Raiden May. Raiden May, Expe, Acheron themes. Like, I'm very excited in the next Archons and the main characters and stuff. That's that's like my problem right now. It's like, okay, show me, show me like the main characters that I really want to see. <laughs> Listen to these these NPCs squabbling about their problems. I'm not connecting with it yet. I need I need a I need a compelling character to connect with. This must be one of the people Ayaka asked us to help. Why would she ever want us to help someone like him? Maybe we should talk to Kurosawa and see what he has to say. Inazuma is where we first start getting long world quests too. Content explodes from there. Isn't so what I think happened, right? Now this is just a theory and I'm pretty new to the Genshin Impact community, right? So this is just a theory. But it feels like to me, like Liyue, Mondstadt and a lot of Liyue was developed before the game really got popular, right? Because, like, Inazuma, wasn't Inazuma the 2.0 patch release? So I think that that makes a lot of sense, right? It makes a lot of sense why after the game got really, really popular and blew up, they would have more resources and a better idea of what players connected with with, with the story. So I think, I think that makes a lot, a lot of sense. TBH. Liwei and Monsai were released on launch. Yep, that makes sense. They developed things almost a year ahead, so now they're working on launch money. And yeah, Sumeru, yeah, it just gets better from here, right? <laughs> I've never even heard of these emergency provisions. I don't know whether it's rumors or whether they're trying to blackmail me. But either way, it's ridiculous. If I was hoarding supplies, would I still be the poor man I am today? Maybe. Sometimes it really do be like that, unfortunately. No, if you'll excuse me, I've got other matters to attend to. You heard that you lost your vision recently. And that's the first bit of truth I've heard all day. The Shogun's army told me that I was unworthy of my vision. And they said I was slacking off in my work. Apparently... I'd even disappointed the Raiden Shogun. And that's why they confiscated my vision. Damn! Strange. What? You're helping enforce the Vision Hunt Decree. Why would you be unworthy of your vision? What? To be perfectly honest, I don't seem to remember the details. This is a recurring theme. After people lose the vision, they don't remember the details. All I know is that I would perform certain things every month. But I don't recall what they were. And... It's not just that. I have this unsettling feeling like like someone owes me something. Shout out to the dog lurking. Does it have to do with the missing emergency provisions? You see, bro? I didn't take any. <laughs> like I said, if I was taking them for myself, I wouldn't be going through such hard times right now. To top it all off, my house was just raided by treasure hoarders. Which is why I came here in the first place. I was chasing after them when I got held up by these two. 
You want a compelling character? You'll meet a lovely girl in a few missions. You fell in love at first sight? I'm excited. I'm excited. If you don't believe me, I'm excited. Go find the treasure hoarders yourself. If there were any emergency provisions to be had, they would have found them. Huh. He seems to be telling the truth. But I don't know who it is. Don't tell me who it is. But I'm excited to see. up those treasure hoarders and see what they have to say. I'm excited to see. We should be able to follow their tracks. They couldn't have gone too far. Yuzumo was released during COVID as well. Yeah, it's... Uh, I, I don't know why I never played... Okay, I know why I didn't play Genshin Impact during COVID. It's because I was like, I'm not a weeb. I'm not a weeb. I don't like anime. I still thought when when the coronavirus first started, I was not an anime enjoyer. Okay, I was not. I was not team anime. I wasn't there yet. I wasn't there yet. I remember at some point in 2021, I downloaded Genshin Impact and I played for like a little bit, and I was like, yeah, you know what? I don't like. I like this, but I don't like. I don't like like anime stuff. And uh, Robin, not a weeb. I'm really, I'm really not. I'm really not. I'm excited to watch. Uh, we really outdid ourselves this time. I am excited. I'm excited to watch L Yuru Camp, Laid Back Camp, Season Three. I'm excited for Oshinoko Season Two. Uh, but like, I didn't watch Jujutsu Kaisen. Free Ren. I need to watch Free Ren. I now that Free Ren's done, I need to watch uh, watch. But like, I'll probably watch in terms of anime. I'll probably watch. Uh, I watched three to four animes a year i'll usually pick two or three things that are airing like as they go on and then i'll watch something like kind of older i would say i really i'm really i enjoy like drama tv shows like i'm obsessed with like the walking dead whatever's on hbo um stuff like that all those samurai houses packed with goods <laughs> we really hit the jackpot i mean besides that one house you haven't seen anything yet. There'll be a lot more where this came from. Today's just the beginning. I'll be leading you all on an epic journey of pillage and plunder that will go down in hoarder history. I think this dude's about to get clowned. You demand, boss. These seem like the treasure hoarders we're after. Let's teach him a lesson. Let's go. Cause of death, yapping. Death by yapping. <laughs> <laughs> that was dude has put up a pathetic Aurora. performance we worked hard to steal that you know come on boss think of something <clears throat> not bad kid you ever think of joining the treasure hoarders we could use some tell us what you know sour. oh i remember the bloom was so strong yeah i've been working i've been working on my nahita so we've been, the we've one been quietly us, leveling huh? up our nahita <laughs> just our luck I knew we shouldn't have hit that place. So what did you see inside? Was it stuffed with food supplies? Food supplies? <laughs> you kidding? That place was a complete mess. All we found was a strange looking box, hopefully with valuables inside. We need like a journal. We need a vision. I didn't want anyone else to see it. So I was planning on opening it myself once we got back. Was there a battle going on up in the up in the hills? Did y'all see that? But now that you've caught us, how about we make a deal? That little box for our freedom. What do you say? You've got a deal. Now show us what's in the box. Huh? What's in the box? What's in the box? What the? Th there's nothing in here but IOUs. Yeah, a lot of them too. And they all seem to be made out to the owner of a general goods store. A Miss Aoi. Owie. We're talking tons of Mora here. Yeah, she's owed a lot of dollars. We better talk to this Miss Aoi and get to the bottom of this. Let's go. As for you guys, you're free to go. Just pray that our paths don't cross again. You almost stole his debts, right? Yes, of course. What fools? So it's like you're now legally responsible for this. <laughs> uh, does that mean we broke even? Shut it. Let's just get out of here. Let's go. Let's see. I am enjoying. You know what? I will say. I will say. I really, I truly am. 
enjoying my time in Inazuma. Every once in a while, like I would say, we I looked yesterday. We've we've done 16 Genshin Impact streams so far. Okay, I would say that only two of them were kind of bad streams for me. Usually, like I didn't enjoy the story or anything. Um, and those streams were kind of rough. The the one stream where we fetched quest for Zhang Li and Li Wei, I ended that stream and I was like, dude, like nothing happened in the story today. And then that's how I felt Tuesday when we really got to Inazuma as well. I was like, nothing, nothing happened in the story today. It kind of sucked. Okay, now stuff is happening. Now, now we're cooking. Okay, now the story is underway, and I'm enjoying my stay in Inazuma. I sure, sure, sure am. Welcome back, Momoshi. Hello, Shino Beans. <laughs> Why are they afraid of Paimon? I don't understand either. Perhaps it's because, I don't know, she, she, she has gremlin energy. She really, really does. She really, really does. Let's talk to the lady. Aoi. Welcome to Tsukumomono Groceries. We've got everything you need. Can I help you find something? Or perhaps there's something you want to inquire about? Uh, about these IOUs. Ah, so you're friends of Kurosawa, I take it. <laughs> perhaps you're here to pay off his debts. Whoa, whoa, let's not get ahead of ourselves. We're just here to learn where they all came from. How did Kurosawa end up owing you so much money? Did he buy anything <laughs> super expensive here? Let me think. Kurosawa would come regularly to purchase large quantities of foodstuffs. He'd always put the payment on his own account. However, the price of provisions began to skyrocket recently, and his salary was no longer enough to cover the cost. Oh so, no! Wait. He started writing out IOUs to cover whatever he couldn't afford of the usual amount. Wait, so oh no! That's how he was getting those emergency provisions. But why did he have to purchase a usual amount? If the price is increased, couldn't he just buy less? Well, right? if you think about it, the citizens receiving the emergency provisions must have been carefully calculating how much they needed to sustain them each time. This is where the Inazuma Kurosawa Adventure Guild is? It, it, it looks like that, doesn't it? Disappointment for them if they found they didn't have enough. Where's Especially Catherine? Is she going to come out from behind the... Careful planning. Behind the back? So he deemed it necessary to take on the debt rather than let the people down. Where my girly Catherine at? Wow. Kurosawa was purchasing all the emergency provisions at his own expense. And no one ever appreciated what he did. They just complained and held him accountable. People's attitudes will always reflect their circumstances. In the face of hardship, nobody cares to think twice. Uh, if you ask me, had Kurosawa told everyone the truth about the supplies from the start, then there wouldn't be such a severe backlash now. Of course, I'm sure there would still have been some unrest. What he was doing was truly a thankless deed. As for why he chose to spend his own money on emergency provisions and never tell anyone, I'm still not too clear myself. So, did they take away his vision? He said that they took away his vision because... He was underperforming on his duties, but it was actually because he owed a lot of debts, or was it a little bit of both? Feels like if they both seem like reasonable, reasonable things, right? If you're still curious, why don't you go ask him yourself? He doesn't remember. But did they wipe out his his debts? Would be just because he had a vision? Yeah, I know Raiden Shogun doesn't like people to have visions or ambitions. I see. That reminds me, it seems that his vision was recently confiscated. Most unfortunate. If he doesn't clear the debt on his name, he'll have no choice but to sell that sword that is so dear to him. In your opinion, they should make parts of the main quest like this kind of like side quests? Like, what does this have to do with the main story? Honest, generally, uh, generally, I kind of agree. Sword? But... These stories are actually a little bit compelling, oh, right? 
didn't he? At least these characters have like he stories that we care about. Very valuable a little bit. He's carried it for years now. I've asked him about its origins. He told me that it was a gift from his father, that it was too precious to sell. I think this is a tremendous upgrade from Zong Li's like fetch quests. Zong, our shopping day with Zong Li, that was terrible. Okay? But this this is a much better improvement, I would say. Hi, Shimo. How are you doing today? So, Rohan. Hello, please. How are you doing today? Dingo Panic. Hello, please. Welcome, welcome. How are you doing today? In hindsight, I regret that I never made an offer on it. Everything has its price. At least that's what I think. Why don't you ask him about the sword yourself? Okay. Perhaps it'll even provide you with the answers you're looking for. Okay. Oh, but before you go... If you would kindly settle today's bill. <laughs> but we didn't buy anything. She charged for her time. <laughs> Information <laughs> yep. is oh, also yeah. a kind of commodity. Wouldn't you agree? Hello, please. We're doing pretty good. Dingo, how are you doing today? Don't worry. I won't charge much for information about Kurosawa. Nothing we ever discussed was explicitly confidential anyway. Oh, let me think. 2,000 mora should be a fair price. Fair enough. That sounds reasonable. Is that's not even like a lot of Mora to me, right? Like I got, I have a bunch of Mora. At least we now know where the emergency provisions are coming from. Plus, we found out that Kurosawa has a priceless sword in his possession. Yeah, I want to see Let's it. Let's go talk to Kurosawa again. I want to see Kurosawa's sword. Anything. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go see what Kurosawa has to say. We're watching Pluto one chapter at... Oh, Pluto one chapter a day. I hope you enjoy, Dingle Panic. I hope you enjoy. I hope you enjoy. We're doing this here, Inazuma Archon Quest. Here in Genshin Impact. Have us some fun. Go. I presented them with a choice. Either they left or I drew my sword. They left. Whoa, he threatened them? It turned out to be a real time saver, actually. Perhaps I should start using it more often. Did you manage to track down the treasure hoarders? Everything I said was true, right? Actually, you are in crippling debt. <laughs> that just about sums it up. It turns out that you really were distributing emergency provisions, but they were all purchased at your own expense. Strange. Is that really the kind of person I was? Oh, yeah. I don't really have any such recollection. Even after all you've told me, I still don't remember anything. Why was I purchasing emergency provisions for everyone? And why would I put myself in such a difficult situation? <sighs> really don't understand but i cannot deny that when i brandished my sword to scare those two away i could sense that my body was somehow reluctant to do so i need to see your sword do you mind if we have a look and this sword was once wielded by my father i remember once when i was young i wanted to sneak out with the blade and show it off to the kids next door my father ended up catching me in the act and scolded me severely. Damn. What did he say? <sighs> I can't seem to remember that either. It would seem that I forgot many important things when my vision was taken from me. So many memories gone. Forever. No matter how hard I try to remember. That would suck. That would suck. I would hate to lose my memory. It's such a horrible thing. When it happens... It's such a horrible, horrible, terrifying thing. All I can remember now is my father telling me that this blade bore his life's creed. Before he passed away, he placed the sword in my hands and said to me, With this sword, you should... You should what? Hey, if you look carefully, there seems to be some words engraved on the hilt. Bye-bye, sarcastic herder. I hope you have a good rest of your day. I hope to see you soon. 
Can you recognize the words? The words are virtue and justice. Virtue and justice? For sure. Somehow those two words seem to explain everything now. Taking on seemingly endless debts to make others happy. <laughs> I guess that must have been my greatest ambition after all. That's just... Uh, what? But what use are virtue and justice? I purchased the provisions for those in need. Right? And look how things ended up. That's what I'm saying. The Tenryo Commission sees my vision. And the very people I was so desperately trying to help refused to understand me. This... I don't understand. What... what it, this is an unfortunate situation. And the irony of all of it is... I somehow still felt sorry when threatening them with my blade. I'm incapable of being a good person. Yet I'm equally unable to be bad. I... I don't know what to do with myself. Yet another troubled soul. When we get the chance, let's speak to Toma about Kurosawa's debt. The Yashiro Commission would surely help cover his expenses. Are we sure? Do are we sure that they would? In any case, we must never let him sell off that sword. Losing a vision. Yeah. Seems like losing all ambition is a terrible experience. Yeah, it's horrible. Yeah, that seems terrible. Fortunately for us, you don't have a vision. Let's go find the next poor soul. Jesus, Paimon. Jeez. Paimon, please. Do you see what she has to say? You see what Paimon is yapping about? Yeah, we're just going to leave just like that. Yeah, be, be like, yeah, you know what? It's fine. You're, he's a he's a big boy. He'll he'll sort it out himself, right? <laughs> Paimon doesn't give a damn. Paimon actually doesn't give a damn about that. Well, she said that the commission would like help his death, so maybe she does. But like, I saw that look in her eyes. She didn't. It it was none of her none of her business. That is not what she came here to do. She wants to meet the Raiden Shogun. I don't know. Sometimes I feel like Paimon is more altruistic than i am sometimes the the, i feel the opposite who had their vision taken is supposed to be a famous sword master around these parts paimon heard that he's the present day master of make your shisui art sounds pretty impressive this is his dojo luckily there's some people around let's go talk to them let's yeah don't worry since they will be fine those thugs that challenged the dojo were strong but he fought them all off in the end, didn't he? Maybe, but I'm still worried about him. Things have gotten dangerous before in the past, but it's never shaken him. This time, though... Sometimes she goes gremlin mode. Yeah, sometimes Paimon goes rot Paimon mode. And uh, she's pretty, she's pretty funny. <laughs> it's just because he's been possessed. I like her. That's all. I still like Once Paimon. Once the exorcism has taken place, he'll be right as rain in no What time. did they say? Yo, what did they say? Sounds good, Lost Ross. I hope you have a good night. And thank you, Dingo Panic, for lurking. I appreciate y'all. Hey there. Did something happen? Who are you? I don't care whether you're trespassers or just here to harass us while Sensei is impaired. Get out of here immediately. Don't make me draw my blade or you won't live to regret it. No, you got it so wrong. Um, we just came here to uh, uh we're here to become disciples disciples uh, yep yep we've heard all about the mighty master of make your shisui art it's the whole reason we came all this way to seek him out and ask him to train us but then we got here and overheard you talking about how he got possessed or something hmm from the way you're dressed it doesn't look like you're from around here Please, accept my apologies. We've had so many people trying to cause us trouble recently that we're on high alert. You haven't oh. arrived at the best of times, I'm afraid. On high alert. Since they got possessed recently, <laughs> and he's still recovering. He's not able to take on any new disciples for the time being. I'm not going back until I can call him my sensei. I see you are earnest in your pursuit. <sighs> okay, how about this? 
My fellow disciple Nanako and I will explain Sensei's situation to you in a little more detail. Then you can decide whether to stay or to leave. Okay. Sensei's name is Domon. A name I'm sure you've already heard. I haven't, actually. Tell me more. Tell me more. Though self-taught, he mastered the art of the sword to a high level. He then proceeded to defeat many other prominent sword masters, never losing a single fight. Folks, he have I, am I supposed to know who they, to they're talking the about? sword master in the world. And so, even while training us, he continued to hone his own art. His fervor truly inspired us, and we trained hard, determined to keep up with him. But then... No clue? Yeah, I don't know this guy. I'm not. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I'm okay. had his vision taken away. He hasn't been the same since. He says the strangest things over and over, and he refuses to let us train. They really are just Junior snatching up visions. It and, and we both think that he's being possessed by an evil spirit. Stealing so ambition. It's crazy. The Grand Narukami Shrine to perform an exorcism. It's crazy. I, exorcism. Honest, it's crazy. I still have my doubts over whether he'll completely recover. It's crazy. The Grand Narukami Shrine. What's that? You haven't heard of it? It's the largest shrine on Narukami Island. The head shrine maiden is reputed to have very close ties with the are we going up there? Shogun herself. Wait, are we going up there? Not that we'd have any means of involving the head shrine maiden, of course. But even one of the ordinary shrine maidens from the Grand Narukami Shrine would have clear power and authority to perform an exorcism. So don't worry, Nanako. Sensei is going to be just fine. The exorcism will take place this evening. You're both more than welcome to come and watch if you're interested. So, losing your vision can cause possession? I uh, guess we should come back this evening and see for ourselves. Okay. Come back this evening. Folks, how is everybody doing? Thank you so much to everybody who's hanging out with me today. If you're lurking and listening, or if you're chatting with me, I really, really appreciate you. And I hope you're having a good, good day, okay? How's everybody doing? Let's uh skip the time. Where do we where do we need to go to? Does anybody has anybody thought about participating in viewer polls for the upcoming content? We have Acheron viewer polls open. Six reverse 1999 polls are open. Uh if you ever wish me to pull on Genshin, that form is open. It's all pinned at the top of the Twitch chat box, okay? Uh also in case people didn't see at in the discord i don't want to post the application like just like super super publicly but uh moderator applications are open for our channel so i thank everybody who's applied so far and if you'd like to help participate and make our community a better place uh please consider filling out the application okay Shh. wait hell divers on the second come. monitor yo i hope so you're having fun arrive any earlier you would have had to witness sensei one of his fits of madness i have something controversial to say i actually refunded helldivers 2. just now when nanako was attending to him she heard him whispering a few names to himself when she asked him who the people were he suddenly looked panic-stricken and pushed her away it looked like he was in great distress he was covering his ears and looking frantically around him with bloodshot eyes yikes all the while, we kept calling those names. Some of them we knew. Others we didn't recognize. But they all seemed to be the names of sword masters he had defeated in the past. Damn. One of them was Anzai. He used to be a fellow disciple of Sensei's. His senior, in fact. But Sensei defeated him in a duel many years ago. And he has been a wanderer ever since. Sensei wouldn't stop calling his name. <sighs> Thankfully, the Shrine Maidens managed to subdue him, so the exorcism can finally continue. Is there, like, not a better solution than literal exorcism? The ritual has now begun. All we can do is patiently await the result. Here's hoping Sensei will be back to his normal self very soon. Wasn't to your liking? It was a, it was like a fine game and anything. I just didn't feel any sense of like stakes. Like the fact that you could like die and just respawn 
pretty much without like any consequences and stuff. I didn't really like it. I didn't think the gameplay was good enough, right? I, I didn't, yeah, I just, I didn't kind of, I didn't get anything right out of shooting endless hordes of bugs and robots. I, I, it, Please, I didn't click with me. me for a moment while I fetch some water. If he wakes up, he is sure to be thirsty. I like PvP games or I like, like competitive PvE games, like, sto like story games. I don't know. Just like, like players, like co-op playing against I don't know, like, I used to like Destiny. I did a lot of the Destiny raids. Um, but I didn't, I don't know, I just didn't, I didn't like it. It wasn't for me. And I did, I did try it with friends and stuff. And I just, I didn't, I don't think it's for me. Not my speed. Huh? Why the, yeah, why is bro running? Who is it? We won't let them get away with it. Come on, let's go after them. What's happening? <laughs> hmm. Seems they aren't here. Should we keep going further up? Hmm. Is this definitely the right place? Is it? Let's look a little further up. Let's go. Keep going. Up, up, up. We gotta go. Whoa. There's some up here for me. Radiant Spin Crystal 49. That's a four-star relic? Yo. Did you try Baldur's Gate 3? I'm gonna play Baldur's Gate 3 one day in retirement. I I couldn't I couldn't let it take over my stream. I know I like Dungeons and Dragons. I like D, &D and I didn't want my stream to become Baldur's Gate 3 for like months and months and months. I have friends. I have friends who played Baldur's Gate 3 and I love many of my friends and I enjoyed many of their Baldur's Gate 3 streams, but I don't I don't think I don't think it's a good ga game to stream. I don't like I don't think it's a good game to stream. There's nobody who's going to be invested in like your story of Baldur's Gate 3 as like you are. How? How did you catch up with me? So quickly. Well, you're an NPC and I'm the traveler. Are you sure you're Dolmon's disciples? You move even quicker than he does. Unless... I guess it's been a few years. Maybe his skills have improved again. Um, excuse me? We're the ones asking the questions here. First off, who are you? Because Robin will be doing all the 18 plus stuff. I think it's not safe to stream. No, that's not true, Justin. Also, welcome in. Hope you're having a good day today. Um, that's not why. That's legit. That's legit not why. Um, but uh, like, I just I do tend to keep like I wouldn't say that my streams are 18 plus. I would say that generally like my streams are probably safe for work, right? But that that I wouldn't say that that was a factor in why I wouldn't play Baldur's Gate three. I mean, one of our first games that we streamed was Doki Doki Literature Club, right? I would say that was our first, like, really, like, successful series on our stream. So, I'm not, I'm not like, afraid of 18 plus stuff. It's, uh, it's just usually not my primary focus. And what are you doing sneaking around these parts? Hmm? You seem like bad news, mister. Like, no, no disrespect or no, not to say anything negative about streamers or vtubers or content creators who create or represent their content as being 18 plus i follow many of them i watch some of them sometimes um not to say anything bad about them that's just that's not exactly a way that i feel comfortable representing myself or my streams or my community you know i'm kind of i'm kind of like i'm kind of shy about stuff like that bad news <laughs> I'll have you know I'm I say so. side by side with Domon back in the day, long before you ever showed up. Yeah, I would say I'm like PG-13. I don't care to talk about yeah. that time anymore. But if you must know, I am Domon Sr. That's that's where I would grade myself, TBH. Wait, that means you must be... Anzai, yes, that's me. 
Why did you run? Because I don't wish to see Dolmon or anyone else associated with him ever again. When we were young, we trained under the same sword master, studying Make Yoshi Sui art together. I had begun training five years before him, and everyone looked up to me as a steady and dependable older disciple. Practitioners of Make Yoshi Sui art seek to achieve stillness of mind, freedom from all agitation. So the majority of disciples are indifferent to rank and reward. I was no exception. But Domon was different. The first thing he did when he joined was go straight to our sensei and ask him, with a beaming smile on his face, how to become the best in the world. Sensei the best, scolded the him and told him <laughs> that the art of the sword should not be used for such vain ends. Sensei said that coveting the title of the best sword master, barely days into his training, showed that he had a fickle mind and that this would impede him from ever mastering the blade. It would be weird to see you not say so. Well, never say never, right? Not to say that I will always be PG-13. Not to say I will always be super, super say so. You never know what the future may hold. But I'm aware that like I do have an all-ages audience. So if I ever did that, right, it would be a very conscious decision. And it would be, I definitely wouldn't want anybody who's not supposed to see anything like that see anything like that so that's another factor definitely it is like it's something that i consider but it's it doesn't come from a place of like oh i need to like act away like that's just like i don't i don't make those sort of jokes in my personal life like i that's just not that's not really my personality honestly like i'm somewhere on the ace spectrum but i don't I don't, but I, that's not how I would describe myself, right? I thought so too at the time. But I'm definitely but somewhere on that began spectrum. Making swift progress in his training and even started catching up with me. Only then did I realize that it was Dobon who had long since freed his mind from all agitation. He was consumed by his singular desire to become the best in the world. He sought nothing less than perfection in the art of the sword. And nothing could deter him from this goal, no matter what stood in his way. I probably consider myself Demi. TBH. I need, I need like a personal connection with somebody. Sure sounds like he meant business. So how come you don't want to ever see him again? Because until he arrived, I was convinced that I would succeed our sensei as the master of Mekyo Shisui art. Of all the disciples... I was the most gifted. I had trained the longest. Everyone had high expectations for me. Dolmon's arrival changed everything. When we sparred, I lost not just the match, but my pride and my status too. Damn. I fled the dojo that day and never looked back. Shameful. Later, I heard that he sparred with Sensei too. Sensei was advanced in years by then. And unfortunately, that match used up every last ounce of energy in his body. That's not good. After that, I wanted nothing further to do with him. Deep down, though, I still respected his mastery of the blade and his commitment to the art of the sword. So, when I heard rumors that he had lost his mind, my first reaction was to dismiss them as false. How could he, of all people, have lost his mind? Hello, please, His Ligma. mind was the sharpest of them all. Ooh, he had ooh. practiced Make Yoshi Sui art to perfection. Ooh, ooh. I decided to quietly come and see if it were true. That was an okay one. Then, that was a decent to one. To my complete astonishment, I heard him call my name. I thought mine was a name he had long since forgotten. So you see, I came here not to cause him any harm. I just wanted to see for myself. Okay. You've heard my story. You should get back now. The exorcism is probably finishing. This is. Do wait. Do I not even he get to see the exorcism? Time. He wasn't here wait. To mess up the exorcism at all. I kind of wanted to see so, it. Paimon's not sure we should bring him back with us. Uh, wait, but I kind of wanted to see it. coming along. Wait, but I kind of wanted to see the exorcism. Can we see that. Show me the way. 
Give me the exorcism. That's just crazy. You're saying he isn't possessed? Right. That's you what everybody is common lost knowledge. His mind? But how, how is that possible? No, no, I refuse to believe it. Something's clearly wrong. Monaco, please try not to get agitated. I am sorry. With what powers I have, I can find no sign of any malignant spirit having possessed Domon. Hi, but Straw Slime. Yes, this is Genshin myriad of forms in this Impact. We're playing Genshin Impact today. To How you doing today? Himself. Thus, Hello, please. I dare not rule out possession with complete certainty. Hello, and please. all is certainly not lost, for I received word not long ago that Lady Yai has taken an interest in your sensei's case. L Lady Yai? Is that... The same Lady Yai that I think you mean? The head shrine maiden of the Grand Narukami Shrine? That's wonderful news! Then Sensei will be sure to recover! You fell from my trap? Correct. Wait, what do you mean? Lady Yai is most knowledgeable indeed. What's the trap? Why did you trick me? Why you trap me? Evil spirits and aversion <laughs> of great calamities. I am doing pretty good today. We have stepped into Inazuma. We're working on some of this Inazuma Archon quest. We're in Act 1. We're having a good, good day. How are you doing today? I am unable to say for certain whether an evil spirit has possessed your sensei, but Lady Yai can give a conclusive verdict. Excuse me, Miss Inagi, but I must ask, should we prepare a greeting gift for Lady Yai? It, it wasn't a trap. Nobody would read that exactly what she said. Dude, if you come into streams and you say, is that Genship Impact? People are going to assume that you made a typo. It doesn't make the streamer dumb for saying Genshin Impact. Dog, it looks like you made a typo. If everybody, like, if you try that, if you, do you, have you ever said that, like, in another chat before? And the streamer just reads it as, like, Genshin Impact? Yeah, that's because they think that you made a typo. That, that's what happened. That won't be necessary. You didn't trick me. I just assumed you made a typo. You I thought you made a mistake. <laughs> at the Grand Narukami Shrine. Lady Yai does not like to be kept waiting. No, it's okay. I'm not I'm not like upset or anything. I'm just it's just like it's, it looks it looked like a typo. I must leave now, but we will meet soon at the shrine. I wish Domon a full and speedy recovery. Who'd have thought Lady Yai herself would have taken notice of our sensei's case? Do you mean to say that Sensei isn't renowned enough to deserve Lady Yai's attention? No, no. That's not what I meant at all. You misunderstand me. I just mean this is Lady Yai, the head shrine maiden. She has direct and close contact with the Almighty Shogun herself. Um, anyway. Almighty Shogun? Raiden Shogun mentioned. Given Raiden Shogun mentioned. All this way just to meet our Sensei. We, the disciples of Mikio Shisui Art, would do our best to help you. I will gladly join you. Sure. After all, everyone seems pretty excited about Lady Yai. We're curious to meet her too. Who knows? Maybe we'll be able to find out a thing or two about the Raiden Shogun from her. Please, I would like to hear more about Raiden Shogun. I've been, we've really been teased, okay? I've wanted to get to Inamizuma. It's been, okay, it's probably been six total hours i would say right of inazuma stuff where first we had to do the martial arts tournament in leeway cringe um we had to we had to uh how am i gonna get up to this area i should have got this oh th there's a path oh it's convenient um wait how am i gonna get up there wait how am i gonna get there Robin, I think you'll like Yay. Yeah, I like I like Yay Miko. I almost pulled for Yay Miko. I almost did. I almost did. Raiden is good and all. Yay is yeah. She's very sussy. She's very sussy. I hear that Yay Miko is a girl kisser. Is that true? I like that. Is that true? I almost call myself the one of these days. There might be a day where I call myself the Sapphic. Shinobi. I don't know. She's a girl kisser? I like that. I like that. There's a shit between Shogun and Ye. I just saw... I saw a tweet one time. And it was like... 
I don't know. I, it like came across my tour you. It came across my like for you page on on Twitter, and it was just like it was like a. I think it was a lesbian woman who was celebrating like the Ye Miko statue, right? And and she was like, "We claim her," and I was like, "Cool, okay, I get it." <laughs> no, I don't have her. I don't have Ye Miko here. I'll show my character list. Is there a better? It's the team setup that shows the best. Nahida, no! Here's my here's my character list. Nahida, Shingsho, catching. Yao Yao, and then the pulled characters I have include Kabe, Gaming, Zinyan. Faruzan, Lynette, of course, and Dory, and Dory. Me with a certain good boy. Okay, don't tell me who. Uh, we'll find. We'll find out. <laughs> She's a lady lover, a girl kisser, a woman watcher. I like all these things. You should upgrade Gaming. I don't want to. That's why. I don't want to. They're good, but you prefer Beto? Beto's pretty cool. I liked Beto. Uh, the only reason, like, I would say that I didn't like Beto, like, I wouldn't, I, like, the stuff that, the content that we met Beto in sucked. You know, like, the monster, the martial arts tournament sucked. And I like martial arts, right? Like, I'm a big UFC fan. Basically, I stream on Saturdays, except for the big one UFC event a month, right? Like, the pay-per-view. I watched I watch that UFC event. So if you ever want to know what days I'm going to stream on Saturdays or not, right? Like look to see if the if the big UFC like if the UFC title fight is on cuz I'm I'm usually watching it. But uh like I like martial arts and I thought that I thought that storyline sucked. He's a good character, but I don't want to. I appreciate you Arkans. I do I do I do. I sure do. <laughs> I'm. This has been kind of fun to cl to climb up here. He tried to sell Kazuha too much. I didn't like. I didn't like Kazuha. I didn't like Kazuha at all. Bro came up. Bro sounded like Kazuha sounded like he smoked a whole ounce of something green, and then just started like yapping, yammering on about some stuff that happened in the past. I was like, what? He was talking about, and I know that's a very very like shallow characterization of Kazuha but from my perspective right he showed up and talked really slow and like about stuff that like wasn't relevant bro like he came out and started like like he info dumped about me about a lot of stuff and I, I didn't I didn't know I wasn't prepared hi phantom how are you doing today welcome welcome hello please her hangout quest did her justice. You're talking about Beto? Beto? Beto seems cool. I just, yeah, I just didn't want, I didn't like the content that we met her in. Like, I hope that she has a better, I hope that she has a cooler role in the story going future, in the future. Oh, we got the teleport waypoint. I'm never making that trip ever again. <laughs> Let's go into the Narukami Shrine and see the head shrine made. And hello, please. How do I get in? I just have to go around. This is fancy. I this place looks cool as hell. This is a pretty tree. Yeah, Miko. Oh, no wonder Junior is so excited. Yeah, Miko. She has a really striking presence. I'm sorry, I was yapping. I must have not realized that we were coming out to see Yai Miko. I knew that Yai Miko was in Inazuma, right? I knew she was an Inazuma character, but I did not realize we were running up here to uh, meet Yai Miko. But I'm very, very excited. She's she's definitely really cool. Also, is 
it just Paimon? Or did she look right at us just now? This is exactly what I was looking for. This is exactly what I was looking for. Dude, I need a main character that I'm interested in, and I need to meet her in the story. This is this is what we've been waiting for. We're hooked now, folks. Robin, your makeup is off. Fix it real quick. Oh, no. I, yeah, right. I have to look pretty for Yaimiko. I have to hold on. I have to look perfect and pretty for Yaimiko. Eh, it was probably <laughs> nothing. It's not like she's ever seen us before. Keep away. Keep away from me. I gave up the art of the sword. Please, let me go, I beg you. As you I should have pulled her. Lady Yai. I should have pulled Tomon her. has persisted in this state for some time now. He appears to see those who have lost to him in duels past, gathered all around him to persecute him. I liked her gameplay, too. I liked Yaimiko's gameplay, too. I played her character trial, I posted the video on YouTube, and I enjoyed her gameplay as well. Dang it. Lady Yai, I messed it up. Must be a possession, right? This is not I messed up for real. In the past, <laughs> no matter what came his way, he would always face it with a, a confident smile. She will come back. We'll get her next time. For sure. I'm sorry. It is clear to me that your sensei is not possessed by any evil spirit. Ooh, lovely but, voice. Let's go. Then does that mean he... Hmm, yes. This is a change in the person himself. Unable to cope with the tremendous pressure he was under, he suffered a spiritual collapse. With his wits impaired, he finally descended into madness. As one who is thrown into the sea, though he fights back desperately against his predicament, it does nothing to prevent his descent into the depths. As for what has triggered this change, I believe it must be the loss of his vision. For to be stripped of one's vision is to be stripped of one's ambition. Right. So true. Honestly, so true. I feel like Yai is a Yuri writer. Not sure if girl kisser. Yuri writer? Female Yuri writer? She's a girl kisser. We, we like it. We respect it. Everyone says she's weak. Yeah, but I liked I liked her lazy gameplay. I liked her lazy gameplay. Just like it felt like I was putting like sentry turrets on the ground. You know, and they were just doing all the work for me. I really liked that. That's also another thing that I liked about Chiori's gameplay. Right is when you summon the puppets and they just kind of like attack stuff. I like I like characters that fight like that. Stripped of his ambition? I do. But I like characters lie. like that. Even without his ambition, why should he suffer such a dramatic change? How does that explain his descent into madness? Your school practices make you shisui art, does it not? Justin, let the girlies have us. Let the girlies have this one. Stillness of mind, freedom from She's all ours. agitation. <laughs> what a fine notion that would be if any in this world could ever hope to achieve it. There was once one who claimed to be indifferent to rank and reward, and who fled enraged when defeated by his junior. And then there was an aged swordmaster who was aggrieved enough that he crossed blades with the disciple he himself had taught. It is it is just so funny to me. Like I'm I'm looking I looked down, I was looking down right now, and I was reading the dialogue, and then I looked up and her voice what, like her mouth is not moving at all. That's it's still pretty funny to me. Then, <laughs> what of the one who crossed blades with his own sensei and beloved fellow disciple and defeated them both? <laughs> Can one truly remain unagitated of still mind in moments such as these? She's so reasonable. Lady, I, I, I'm not sure I understand. She's explaining it. Uh, the path of the sword master is filled with twists and turns. It is no small undertaking to pursue the position of greatest sword master in the world. It requires one to take their sword firmly in both hands and cut down the hopes and dreams of others. Even those of one's closest companions. Sorry, I'm I'm su I'm like super focused on what she's saying. Only a deep commitment to his ambition to become the best made it possible for him to rise above the pain of these encounters. Is she to focus on the way ahead? Is she like? Does she like supernaturally know this? Does she have some like power that lets her see this, or is she just like? Did somebody just tell her the story, and she's? assess this already because this is i mean she's basically made the perfect read when that ambition disappeared 
Oh no, later. Okay, don't yeah, don't tell me. I'm think I'm just thinking out loud. He battled his growing anxiety. He slowly descended into the state you see him in now. <laughs> Much like a certain fatally flawed friend of mine. Ooh, who? Poor Sensei. To think he's been suffering so greatly. I'm sorry. It's all my fault. Father. Sensei. Oh, I'm sorry. Love seeing you so focused on the story. Cool thoughts. See, or that's what I'm saying. See, folks, that's what I'm trying to imprint is when the important stuff happens, I save my energy and my attention for when the important stuff happens and then I lock in and I really, really focus on the story, right? But like a lot of the stuff, like a lot of the quests that we've done up to this point, right? I don't think they'll be referenced in the story again. So, they're, so they didn't like, they didn't like take a lot of priority in my mind. But when, yo, when, when the playable characters are here, the major characters are here, and they're talking about themselves and and the world, right? Like we gotta lock in. That's where we. That's where we're focused on. That's where we're. That's where I'm choosing to spend my attention and my energy. If that makes sense. That's enough. Huh? Isn't that Onsai? Where did he come from? Did he follow us the whole way here? Onsai, why are there two of you? Is that you or a ghost? Wait, wait, what? <laughs> You're here for revenge, aren't you? I knew it would come. I never should have. Wait, what's going to happen? You're right to assume that my feelings towards you are far from kindly. <sighs> but I didn't come here to settle a score. They climbed up this whole mountain just to have this conversation. What, what's going to happen? It's been so long now that I made peace with it years ago. You did nothing wrong that day. I just... I couldn't face the humiliation. That's why I ran. I don't think most of the people you beat along the way would hold it against you. On the contrary, when you cut our ambition short, we entrusted them to you in the hopes that they might carry you further. And he doesn't feel like they did. Now I know that we can't place our hopes in you any longer. Whoa. Since you've been stripped of your ambitions too. But that is no reason Brutal. to strip them of theirs. Follow the way of the sword all the way to the highest peak. You taught them that, didn't you? But what if one day, the same thing happens to them? I put everything I had into trying to become the best. But what if it was all a huge mistake right from the start? I, I am confused as to why we are having this conversation in front of... Yai Miko? Like, is she like... How does she fit into this? If there's a chance they'll end up like me one day, I'd rather they stay where they are now than go any further down this path. Have you asked them what they think? Sensei, after you rescued me from the hands of the pirates, I told myself I would follow in your footsteps for the rest of my days. I can't know. She's here to examine what's wrong with my future as you Sensei. Now. That's what's All happening. I know okay. Is that here and now in the present, I wish to continue. That's what's happened. They said that he was not possessed, so I guess they brought her to Yaimiko to see perhaps what really was the issue. I want to keep going until the day that I can stand before everyone with my head held high and announce that I, like my sensei Domon before me. I'm a master of Makio Shisui art. Nanako's far from the only one. Actually, all of us think that way. Yay! Goodness. Well, I... You see? You can place the ambition you once had in their hands. They're passing the torch to the new generation. Being stripped of your ambition is something that's never happened to me. So I can't claim to understand it. But I do know what it feels like to have your ambitions crushed. That's what happened on the day that you so effortlessly defeated me. Yo! Yo! So, just as I once placed my ambitions onto you, it is time for you to release yours into their custody. This is so cool. You are not in the same position that I was. When I left, I had nothing to my name. But you have a great number of worthy disciples. I... 
I understand. I'm sorry to have made you worry for me and for the state of Miyakyo Shisui art. I no longer have the resolve to become the best in the world. The emptiness and suffering inside of me will not abate, so I cannot hope to still my mind and be free of agitation. But as your sensei, I shall commit to imparting unto you everything I have learned in my life so far. Isn't that what we should have been doing all along? Anyway. This is my promise. And I humbly ask Anzai, my senior, to hold me to my word. You can count on that. I'd be checking in on you occasionally anyway, <laughs> just to make sure you hadn't lost your mind again. So, he understands now that you don't necessarily have to have a vision to lead a fulfilling life. You can have ambition without having a vision, right? He can still enjoy imparting knowledge onto his pupils. But I am now used to the life of a wanderer. I do not belong in the dojo anymore. So I will simply stop by once in a while to make sure you aren't cutting any corners with them. Yeah, you could pass your ambitions to others instead, right? Just because, like, like, I think it's useful to think of vision, visions as ambition, right? Like, I think that's a good connection to make. But I don't think that it's, I don't think, but I don't think that you have to have a vision in order to have ambition you know like i'm sure i'm certain that there are hundreds thousands of people around inazuma who never have nor never will have a a vision but you but you know i think i think one of the reasons that like the species of humans right like all of us on the planet or who have ever existed on the planet like the reason our species is alive is because like You have to have some ambition in some capacity to have a better life tomorrow than you had today, right? So I think this is really, really interesting to see because now we're concluding that you don't necessarily need a vision to have ambition. You see? Well, don't just stand there staring at me. Say thank you to Lady Yai and then get yourself back home. Did I cook? Does it make sense? Did I, 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 I fear I may have cooked a little too hard on that one. I don't know if that's correct, but that's my interpretation of things. <laughs> Big cooker, pressured cooker. So even though his ambition was taken away, his disciples can take it over on his behalf. Guess that sort of solves this one, huh? Yeah, seems like a good resolution as we can hope for. I like Trevor, that ending. A moment, please. Lady Yai has some words for you. Yo, let's so, go. My intuition was correct. The wind that blows from afar carries fresh life to these shores. For us to meet now is premature. Nevertheless, you set foot on these islands at precisely the right moment. Hmm, I have high hopes for you, child. Don't disappoint me. I would never, I would never disappoint Lady Yai Miko. Ever, ever. Ooh, never in my life. Never. Lady Yai seems to have taken never. a real interest in you. Okay. She seems super mysterious. <laughs> Paimon's so curious what she really meant by all that. Hmm. We can come back to it another time. For now, we should go report back to Miss Kamisato. I enjoy powerful women. I do. I enjoy powerful, independent women. I do. You know, women women with lots of agency who make decisions. Powerful, political women. I, I do. I like them. I like Lady Ningguang. It does, it's not like a, for me, it's not like a, it's not like a mommy thing for me. It's like, a, I just like badass characters, you know? I, I do. I like, I like badass characters who don't take nonsense from anybody you know make decisions ha have have lots of agency in their in their life in the way that their story plays out and goes i like that i look at it and i say you know what i like that i like that she's cool quick let's find shelter 
wonder who this gift could be from. <laughs> Abido is badass. Hey, I don't need to know her story to agree that she's badass. I she she pilots a captain, a, a cool pirate ship, and hosts martial art tournaments. I you know what? Bido might even be the coolest character in the game so far. She she's the captain of a pirate ship and she hosts martial arts tournaments. That's pretty sick. That's pretty badass, <laughs> right? I just didn't enjoy like the execution. Like I wish I loved that martial arts tournament. Like I do because I love martial arts. Like following martial arts is one of my hobbies, right? So it was really it was really a bummer for me that I didn't enjoy that particular quest. Uh, because I didn't, you know, I didn't want to go talk to three NPCs that we're never going to, we're going to easily beat, we're never going to mention again. Like, I just wanted to get to Itazuma. So I do, I really hope that I do see more from Baido in the story in the future. Because I like her, she's really, really cool. But I didn't like the particular storyline that she participated in so far, if that makes sense. Used to main Baido before you main Ganyu, before you main Yoima, Yomiya. Yoimiya? I'm not familiar with Yoimiya. Who, who, what character, what type of character is that? I like Ganyu too. Yo, I love Ganyu. I have the, check this out. Check this out. I pre-ordered my Ganyu. I already purchased the Ganyu skin. I don't have Ganyu. But I wanted to make sure that I have the Ganyu skin. The Lantern Right skin advertisement where they, her and Shenhe showed their new skins. It was very, very effective. It was very, very effective for me. <laughs> have a good night, Momoshi. It's very, very good to see. I hope you have a good night, okay? You can see all the characters in the archive? That's probably true. That's probably true. Oh, Ayaka! Guess who fulfilled all your wishes? Oh, this is like a cutscene, cutscene, cutscene moment. How does she know she's not back there? Whoa, how did you get here? Who, who is she? Wait, who is this? Traveler, Paimon. Ayaka! It's a pleasure to finally meet you both face to face. <laughs> Wait, is I've this? I've heard all about how you helped our three friends. My sincerest thanks to you. The damage. I'm gonna tell her. Ay ay ay. Is this wait? Is this where the ay 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 meme begins? I do have folks. If you have better Twitch TV, I do have ay 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 added as an emote. You may. You may. You are uh, legally allowed to ay 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 here. Ay ay ay. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna tell her I'm gonna take this chance to tell her the damage done by losing a vision cannot be completely undone uh, Yeah, short of getting them their visions back. It seems like there's no way to really help them Um, Ayaka How come this time you get to come out and meet us in person? <laughs> because now that you have done the three things I asked of you I consider you to be my friends as you will observe, I'll be your friend. I dispense with the screen for Toma also. It's your big foreheaded baby girl. Yeah, Alyssa, I'm never gonna, I am never gonna like, I'm never gonna, I'm never gonna forget that comment, okay? Ayaka for me will forever be the, my, your big headed, foreheaded baby mm -hmm. girl. <laughs> poisoned, you poisoned her image in my mind. <laughs> maybe not, maybe not like in a bad way, right? But Paimon sure as heck did not sign up to be a servant. Oh. <laughs> Paimon, you are most entertaining. Toma is first and foremost my friend, and was so before he ever became my attendant. Oh. Okay, then. Ayaka, you seem pretty different out in the open compared to how you are behind the screen. Ayaka touched hmm. grass. All right, we can be friends. Ayaka touched grass. Friend request accepted. <laughs> Thank you both kindly. Back to the matter at hand. You have now witnessed the pain of those deprived of their visions. 
What are your feelings on what you have seen? I hope they can one day be free from their torment. I think that it seems to be a fate worse than death. I think this is a pretty harsh... Uh, I think that's a little bit too far. I think that perhaps that's a little bit too far. Let's say, I hope they can one day be free from their torment. <sighs> perhaps in the eyes of a deity such as the Almighty Shogun, the lives of those who inhabit the world are inconsequential. Thunders roar, lightnings flash, the winds assault, and the rains descent. All these things take place with no regard for the feelings of the common people. But I believe that surely you understand what they must endure. It seems that perhaps now you can appreciate my feelings on all of this. In which case, perhaps you would be willing to reconsider your stance? But where's the option to say no? Where's the option to say no? I never said I... Okay, me, personally, as a Robin, I... Uh, like... Uh, 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 I just, how is this going to work? How, wait, wait a second. Hold, hold up a minute. Hold up a minute. How is this going to work? Where Ayaka is going to take us to meet the Raiden Shogun, but she also wants us to help the fight Raiden Shogun's vision hunt degree policy. Wait, how is this, how is this going to work out? How is this going to work out? Robert, I have something to give you. What do you mean, Wolf Knight? What do you mean? You will? Really? I wouldn't have said yes. If there was an option to say no or to say, like, huh? You know, like, dot, dot, dot? I, I would have said dot, dot, dot. You know, like, if, folks, does anybody here ever play, like, a Telltale game? Where you go, uh, where you can just, like, choose to not respond? That's what I would have said there. <laughs> Thank you for the head pass, Wolf Knight. I appreciate you. Naturally. <laughs> you laugh. Right, bravo, my lady. You were right all along. See? I told you she wouldn't reject them. I placed my trust in the right person after all. Now then, given that the remainder of our discussion pertains to matters of a more confidential nature, perhaps we can move to the Kamori Tea House? We ought not to involve other members of the Yashiro Commission. Sure, that works for me. You went on a guilt trip and now you're forced to accept? Unfair, right? Yeah, I think, I definitely feel, I definitely feel, okay, one of my, one of my legitimate critiques of, one of my legitimate critiques of Inazuma so far is that I feel like this writers, I feel like the story has their finger on the scale just a little bit, right? It feels like they're really trying to paint the Raiden Shogun as like a poor leader, as a terrible person. And I'm sure that there will be like a greater twist or a, especially once we under, get to understand her motives, right? But so far, like this first part of the story, it feels like they're just like really, really all in on trying to make us dislike Raiden Shogun and like the establishment of Inazuma. And I think it's just a little heavy handed, right? I think it's a little... Heavy hand. I think they're doing a little too much. I think they're doing a little too much. Well, here we are again. Please continue without me. I'll keep watch. So, what's the deal with this place anyway? What makes it your favorite meeting spot? This is a land that was gifted to the Yashiro Commission by the Shogun. The Kamisato clan has the exclusive right to plan, build, and repair any property on this land. And even to allow or deny access. Such privileges exist due to the Yashiro Commission's role in managing ceremonial affairs. Oftentimes, it is not appropriate to discuss details in front of bystanders. Seems fair. Oh, Paimon gets it! Gotta keep a bit of mystery, right? Once the number of ceremonial affairs conducted in the city began to decline, our forebearers built a tea house here. Only members of the Yashiro Commission are permitted to come and go as they please. Okay. Makes sense. Perfect place for a secret base. In any case, we can talk freely here. I presume you have a few questions that you wish to ask me? Oh, uh, I do. I do, I do, I do. 
uh, have you raised a formal objection to the vision hunt degree? Right? This was my first question. Like, does she know about this? Are we operating in the shadows? Of course. We have tried on numerous occasions. Unfortunately, each time our proposal to repeal the decree arrives at Tenchukaku, it is promptly vetoed by both the Tenryo Commission and the Kanjo Commission, and subsequently scrapped. They invariably adopt a stance of unconditional support for the Shogun's decisions. They have no interest in discussing anything. It almost makes one wonder whether they had a hand in the Shogun's sudden decision to issue the Vision Hunt Decree. What kind of god? Wait, is no one else fighting the Vision Hunt Decree? Let's go in order that makes sense. The issue is this. For the vast majority of people, the Vision Hunt Decree is something that has no implications whatsoever. After all, it is but a tiny minority of people who receive visions. Moreover, it is not unknown for visions to spark jealousy in others. Because of this, the attitude of most people towards the Vision Hunt Decree is one of indifference. Right. How can they be like that? Paimon's getting mad. Why would most people of Inazuma care about this? Right? Like, why would they care about people who have visions? Like, if you don't have vision, right? If you don't have a vision... Would people really care that much? Like, how, like what percentage of Inazumans are vision holders? I, I, I actually would like to know the answer to that question. That's not a rhetorical question. I'd like to know the answer. Like, what percentage of the population are we talking about here? So I can at least understand, like, the general public's apathy. Nevertheless, in addition to us, there was also the resistance on Watatsumi Island. Resistance? You mean like an army fighting against the decree? Yes. Many who have lost or fear losing their visions have rallied together under Sangonomiya on Watatsumi Island to form a resistance group. To say a little more about Sangonomiya, historically, there has always been some conflict between them and the Shogunate of Narukami Island due to their different belief systems. But I do wonder whether there may be some other agenda behind their resistance movement beyond merely fighting the Vision Hunt Decree. What kind of god is the Raiden Shogun? The Almighty Shogun. I've seen her on but only a few occasions, most of them formal ceremonies. She inspires awe, commands respect, and exudes a sense of absolute authority. But as I recall, there was something else about her that struck me even more deeply. Not even 10%? It was her almost complete lack of any emotion. In that sense, she appeared to me to be less of a ruler and more of, well, an executive official, I suppose. Focused exclusively on her single goal of implementing eternity. Acting accordingly without feeling. I have no further questions. Ooh, ooh, Paimon has a question, though. What do you have oh, a question of? What would you like to know, Paimon? Have you got a plan yet to fight the Vision Hunt Decree? Yeah, what's the what's the mode? What's the meme? To what's the plan? Honest, we do not. I gotta come up with the plan? Damn it. What? Please, do not forget that challenging the Vision Hunt Decree is tantamount to challenging a deity. Coming to terms with that is already a difficult step to take. I don't know if these so, people are gonna win. So what are we gonna do? I don't think these people are gonna win. Well, for the moment, why are we siding with these people? All we can do is try and reduce the harm that is being caused by this decree. For example, by providing vision bearers with safe refuge, or manufacturing counterfeit visions for them as a contingency measure. You're telling Paimon that there are people out there who can make fake visions? Don't underestimate the talents of the craftspeople in Hanamizaka. To the naked eye, their counterfeits are indistinguishable from the genuine article. Wait. Must have been where Venti went? Yeah, wait, what, what do they mean by this? The problem we are facing right now is that Master Masakatsu, who was providing us with counterfeit visions, has recently been arrested by the Tenryo Commission. What? They had a counterfeit? Darn! So they found out about it? Set up over here? Dude. Yes. <laughs> we knew it was not a long-term solution. That's crazy. And that it was only a matter of time before it would be exposed. But we cannot simply abandon Master Matsukatsu.
he is saved, it is only right that he should be saved too. Exactly. I feel the same way. But given mine and Toma's identities as part of the Yashiro Commission, this is crazy. breaking him out of prison would risk dragging down the reputation of the entire Kamisato clan should we be caught. <sighs> That would only serve to cast suspicion on any future activity we might seek to attempt. I feel like, I feel like we just, what, I feel like we've gotten a terrible shake of the stick, right? It arrived, we've arrived in Inazuma and we gotta do everything for everyone. This is, this is crazy. Hi, Mr. Witherstorm, how are you doing today? <laughs> Inazuma is the By best no region. Do we intend to place the burden of such a task on your shoulders alone? I'm enjoying it so far. I'm enjoying this part of the story. Now that the story is really getting going, right? I like it. There, you will find someone who can help you. Ayaya's operation is to guilt trip the traveler. It's not working on me, okay? Me, Robin, Osiris, Shinobi, streamer, variety, VTuber. It's not working on me, but uh, it, it appears to be working on the traveler. So I don't, I don't really, I don't really know what to say about all that. <laughs> I don't really know what to say about all that. Um, but folks, uh, the books were more I think that is a good stopping point for the day. I kind of want to walk out and just like run around and yap a little bit, but I don't think we'll continue any, any more, uh, quests today. Please do not spoil the story mister mister i why would i did i i don't know that there's a boss fight don't spoil the story please go to the counter first there's a dog over there i saw the dog go mr wisdom you spoiled that we're gonna there's gonna be a boss fight the raiden boss is insane make sure to enjoy it yeah i don't tell me that there's a boss fight please Folks, we have a no spoiler policy, please. But yeah, that uh, please no spoilers. <laughs> uh, let's end the stream with the doggo. Let's do it, shall we? This is a cute place to end the doggo, folks. I enjoyed, folks. I enjoyed the story today. Once we really got started, you know, really great to meet Yai Miko. Uh, really great to uh, really great to meet Yai Miko. Great to meet Ayaya. We like Ayaya, and I've really I've really enjoyed it so far today. the The beginning of Inazuma has been pretty slow, but I think that uh, it's it's really begun to pick up for sure, for sure, for sure. No, thank you, Royal Brooker. I appreciate everybody who's hung out and enjoyed. I hope that folks enjoyed uh like the story reactions like i said i tried to i tried to um i tried to spin like my attention like i have very limited attention i think we all do these days um but i tried to i tried to spend my very limited attention on the really like crucial crucial parts of the story so i appreciate everybody hi you know ali how are you doing today thank you for papa did and I really, really appreciate everybody. Let's go ahead and switch over here. As Soap says, scatter. It's time to scatter. <laughs> but I really, really, really appreciate everybody hanging out today. Uh, thank you so, so much once again for being here. I'm Robin Osiris, Shinobi streamer and variety VTuber. Uh, folks, the plan is on Tuesday, on Tuesday, we will be playing the new Honkai Star Rail story update, the main story quest update. The new Trailblazer quest, all about Acheron and Adventuring. Uh, we'll be doing viewer pools. That form is posted at the top of the chat. I've just posted it in these chats as well. So if you would like to, for me to pull on your account, uh, please, please, please fill out the form. Uh, we're pulling on. Okay, so real. we're pulling on Reverse 1999 and we're pulling on Genshin Impact. So anything you would like me to pull on, please, please, please feel free to fill out that form. I will only access your account information while we are live on the stream. Okay, I never access it anywhere else. If you'd like to leave your character in like a weird place or whatever, a place you would only you would know, I don't know. But uh, 
we will have a good time we had a lot of fun the last time we did some so i'd like to do them again in the i like to do them again on tuesday yes the new uh star rail 2.1 is tuesday it's tuesday evening it the actual patch is supposed to come out just a little bit later than our actual stream uh but we're gonna go live at our normal time which is 5 p.m pst 8 p.m est and we will uh well so we'll be hanging out we'll do something you know i'm sure we'll get up to something before the patch starts and as soon as the patch begins we will play okay you want to see but you want to play it on your own too i totally understand and i hope that everybody steers clear of my stream if you care about honkai star rail spoilers well it would serve you well to steer clear of my stream on tuesday because we're playing the new story stuff the second it comes out okay so i can post all my reaction videos <laughs> and stuff on youtube folks today during the stream we hit 1000 subscribers on youtube so thank you or not 1000 1700 one 1700 uh youtube subscribers so thank you all so 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 much for your support 1702 right now so really really thank you folks so much i'm really really proud of everything we're doing on youtube so i really thank you everybody so 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 much for your support uh, and i hope you'll check out some of the content on my channel okay uh today we are going to raid our friend well uh, let's see let me take a look at who's who's live let's see who's let's see who's live <laughs> You just leave Jarillo six. You, yeah, you got you got a little ways to go. You got a little. You got a couple ways to go for sure. Uh, let's raid our friend Banana Ramajama. We haven't raided our friend Banana Ramajama before, but this is my friend Banana Ramajama. He is a very good banana boy VTuber. He's a banana. Okay, he's a freaking banana. So I hope you'll consider checking out his stream if you wish to join the raid with us please just feel free to copy and paste any of these raid messages on the screen this one is for subscribers and this one is for everyone so please 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 feel free to join us in the raid okay uh i will see everybody tuesday i will be active on discord uh and everywhere so i hope to see everybody soon i had a lot a lot of fun today inazuma is really like cooking up right it's really getting good uh, so I'm very, very excited. I think that we will probably continue Genshin Impact on Thursday. Thursday. I think that if I had to guess, we'll probably continue Genshin Impact on Thursday because we're doing Honkai Star Rail on Tuesday. Okay? So, until I see you again, take care of yourselves, be good, and bye bye now. Bye bye, Arkans. Bye bye, John. Bye bye, Gogeta Evolution, Justin Jam, Alyssa, Royal Brookerly. Anybody out there who's lurking, listen, watching the future, having a good time. I hope you have a good, good, good evening. Afternoon, morning, wherever it is in the world for you. Thank y'all. I'll see you Tuesday. Bye bye now. <laughs>